All right, I am here. I did manage to get mascara on. We'll see how long it stays. <laughs> oh, and there is a uh, Snemius. He didn't eat the wet food, but I was, uh, he did uh, willingly eat half of a churu. He, he literally noped out of the other half. So he, I, th I thought maybe with it being more liquid, he would <sighs> want to eat it. He couldn't say no to a churu, so <coughs> at least he's got something in his tummy. So if he pukes again, it won't be as, as bad. All right. And I think we're good to go. I couldn't get, uh, I got the headphones synced, but I couldn't get them to play. It was just fuzzy. All right. Good morning. I haven't been crying. You guys have been crying. What do you mean? Your nose and eyes aren't supposed to be this red. Leave me alone. Um, Urchin Rice. Rage. Welcome on in. Joe Blind. Good morning. Raptor. How's everybody's weekend? My weekend was good. The wedding was pleasantly awkward. Pleasantly awkward? She said pleasantly first. Aladrost, good morning, welcome. We are upstairs today. Look at, she's cleaned up a little bit. Um, yeah, we had the wedding on Friday. I, I, Sorry, I need to take care of the loud music that is playing right now. Um, give me a second. There we go. That was just massive. I have new earphones, and I have them synced. Um, let me see here, because I should be able to. Sorry, we're, we're playing around with things this morning. Oop, oop, oop. I've got the headphones. Where's my... I got the headphones connected, 100% battery on them. Good to know. It's so that we can chat in the Discord and I can hear you guys. Synemius is correct. Stitch does have a upset tummy. Um, and I've been calling around every animal hospital in the city and none of them have an opening. So like, it's just, it's just disheartening that nobody is taking new clients. So uh, I'm, I'm looking to travel a half hour to an hour out for my cat. So in between, I'm, I'm going to be like turmoil of emotions. We're going to try to do a four hour stream, but like I've been trying to call vets all morning to try to find an appointment for Stitch. And everybody is not accepting new clients because I'm, I guess one of the other big animal hospitals shut down and their animal dream pool had to get dispersed out throughout. But like, I'm calling places that are like off the freeway now. Um, so Stitch has been, yeah. exactly. <laughs> um, oh, wait a second. It's just yelling. Um, Stitch has been throwing up and last night into today, it's been like the bright yellow, sorry, pardon, it, too much information. If, if you are eating, you don't want to listen. Um, this morning it's been like that bright yellow bile because he just doesn't have anything in his stomach. And so like, I was like, okay, well let's get like some of your favorite wet food then in your stomach. That way, if you puke again, you've got something in there. Um, but he wouldn't even eat that. I, I sat there and like, I was trying to pit rack my brain of like, maybe he didn't want to like chew, didn't want to eat, upset stomach. And I was like, okay, maybe a churro, you know, one of those churros because it's, they're more liquidy, there's less chewing. And so like, he only ha ate half of that and then, and then walked away. So at least he's got something in his stomach. So if he does puke again, he doesn't, you know, I brushed him that one night. Sanemia, like. He was puking up hairballs, so we, like, spent a, a long while brushing him, and then after brushing him, everything's gone, gone downhill. I don't even... Yeah. So there's that, and I lost music, too, all of a sudden. What is going on? I give up with our music today. Um, 
But anywho, so I've, I've been trying to call vets and animal hospitals and animal clinics all over the city. And one of the people go, I get it. She's just a receptionist. She goes, sorry, we're not going to be accepting new patients and clients until the fall. However, if I were you, I would keep calling around. There are a lot more vets in the state. I know it's Monday morning, but holy daft. <laughs> like, can, can we be like a little bit more? You guys have only been open like for an hour, you know, a half an hour. Can, can you just be nicer to somebody calling you on the phone? Like trying not to be on, so like, we're just, I'm just monitoring him. He's, he is going pee. He's just obviously not going number two. So he's drinking, which I guess is a pro. So I'm just, I'm just taking notes and we'll keep calling in between. I'm surprised they, uh, so the one, one place goes, yeah, for an emergency, it'll be like $400 extra. We can get you in today at 10. But then, like, our earliest appointment wouldn't be until the 21st. And I'm just like, okay, I'm going to keep calling. But, like, it's good to know that there's maybe a 21st booking here. Like, I just, I, it's just... <clears throat> So, I've got, I've got, I think it's because I keep pushing the button. Yes, it is. Okay. Let me see if we can put these in and, uh. Yeah, sh okay, so that is me. When I push the outside of this, it turns the music off. That's interesting to know. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, that's. <sighs> so yeah, I, I, I am now reaching outside of the city and I'm gonna go to like the suburb where, where like people with farm animals take their pets. Um, even with pet insurance, there's no such thing as pet insurance. It's called my bank account. It's just, uh, <clears throat> so as much as I like didn't want to stream today, I was like, I need to, there's, even if I'm just continuously calling vets, like I just, the cat's still going to be the cat. I'm still going to be here. We might as well hang out, take my mind off of it. Maybe do some art. Yeah. Cause he's just been laying on the bed too. He's, he's a little bit more lethargic than, uh, than he has been. And this is the first time he's he's been not well so it's 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 taking me off guard too because like he's always okay so on that note let me undampen my eyeballs we don't need this we're here for joy not tears undampen the eyeballs seeing you guys i'm sure you guys wonder like hey does this ever get sad is she always happy? One second. Did I push a button with this stupid ear thing again? Probably, right? Gosh darn it. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing with this this ear ear hole filler. Let me let me yeah, I pushed the button again. Okay. One thing we can do is a stream raiders battle. <clears throat> and I've been taking my allergy pen meds too, so I'm not even like oh, wrong sniffles, wrong sniffles. Another instance is already running. Sure. I don't think it is, because we would see it. Right? Oh where's this? I'm here with my muffin. Press left ear for noise canceling off and on. The right ear plays and pauses. Oh, okay. Well, I don't even have, I have it still. I've got, okay, now I've got them both in. It's like it wants to play through the ear hole but it doesn't at the same time.
Okay, it's coming. I was like, I can't tell if it's coming through these ears or not. Okay, I've got to update this. Are you kidding me? Story of my life. How many times does Stream Raiders update throughout the week? Stream Raiders, you're, you're lucky that my loyalty to small browser games runs strong. You're lucky that I live in a, in a constant dial-up mentality that I'm like, yeah. I'll, ta I'll take your loading, you browser-based game. But then again, at the same time, it also makes sense why I enjoy uh, Neopets as much as I do. That browser-based game. Yeah, but jump like 400 without even, without even like checking out a poop or, or fecal day. I was just like, oh my gosh. Yeah, so if you, if you, if you guys could just send, you know, the feel better vibes to Stitch, I would, I would appreciate it. I would appreciate it. And I'll keep you guys updated. You know, maybe, maybe he, maybe it's something as simple as like the food is now upsetting his tummy, you know, and like. Old man Stitch is just getting sensitive as he gets up there. Ah, uh, you know, like, awesome. I let I will uh, let's let's go drop you know four hundred dollars on new food then. Like I, I'm I'm at like whatever you need, buddy. Whatever you need. Uh, depending on how far you want to drive, I could uh, tell the place I take my pets to that he's my cat and he would take him. Ah. <laughs> uh. I, I, you know what? We'll, we'll keep that one on the back burner, Athla, because again, she made the, there are so many other places in the state. Uh, oh. I was just like, I was, I was, I was just, I was left. My mouth was just like, yeah, there are, but like, you're the fifth place I've called in my city. Uh. Like, <laughs> Huh? <laughs> oh my goodness! I've either I've got to I've got to laugh because it'll just make me sad. Um. So yeah, I'm just I'm just I'm documenting, keeping tabs when he goes to the bathroom. Uh, what he eats. <laughs> this isn't what I wanted. Cat lover sixty nine. Also, art is awesome. All sweet. I am, I, thank you, but you didn't need to do that. I just need to find him a place that will, will take him in. Cat lover, thank you so much. You did not need to do that. I am, I am treading on thin ice. I am, I am. <laughs> thank you, you did not need to do that. Uh, Dr. Rebel, Stitch is just doing is, is got, is, is not doing okay. And I'm having a hard time finding a vet um, that is accepting new patients at this moment in time right now. Um, I just keep calling and calling and calling and calling. Um, and in one place was just a, a bunch of assholes. Um, so like, <laughs> I'm just, that's all, you haven't missed anything. You, you just missed me. This is first, Stitch's first time being sick. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm just, I just can't find a place that'll accept him, um, in a timely manner. And I'm, I'm ready to, you know, drive half hour to an hour away to take my cat to the vet if he needs it. But I got to find a place that will accept new patients, you know this week. So don't, don't, uh, don't be alarmed. Uh, if, uh, actually be thrilled. Let's hope that there is a, um, a break in our streaming schedule. Like, oh no, sorry guys, you know, can't stream. We got to reschedule everybody cheer because that'll mean like we got stitched into the vet. Um, but I'm, I'm just, Thank you so much, Cat Lover sixty nine, for that tip. That is that is very very generous, very generous of you. No, I've called clinics, veterinary hospitals, uh, just veterinary offices. Uh, I think I tapped out at six before. Like I I mentally was just I needed to like collect myself a little bit. Um, yeah, it, it's it's. It's weird. It's very, 
And I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. Did I obviously put Stream Raiders in the corner? Oh, because I was playing with everything. I was trying to get our reactive to work in the Discord, but... Uh... All right. Speaking of Discord. Oh, we are in there, but I'm just... I'm muted. Can I unmute me? I can unmute me. Right? Am I chatting? Hold on. I got to go put a... Sinemias's. Um. Default input is going to go through my wireless Go X desktop. Sure. Output is going to be into my ear holes. It's going to be voice activated. Push to talk. This channel requires push to talk voice, so you will only be able to. Oh, I I see what I did there. I got to give you the moderator privileges to not push to talk, Sinemius. That's gonna be the interesting one. But I should be able to hear you guys in the Discord if you're pushing to talk, because uh, I think yeah, I've got a okay. So I can talk directly to the Discord that way. And then there should be an audio function in here for Discord. It's on. Yep. Um, but yeah, it's, it's just been a whirlwind. It's just been a, you know, and I didn't think anything of it until, you know, we are just monitoring him. And this is going on day three. And it was just bright yellow. And again, like there would have been nothing in his stomach from when he had upset tummy moments yesterday night or this morning. And so I was, again, able to get him to eat, like, half of a churu. Um, so that he's got something in his stomach, because I know he's going to get pukey again. I just feel bad for him. I just, I, there's, like, what do you do? You just feel bad. It's like a cat. And, like, it's not like they can tell you what's wrong. So, like, you're you're sitting here, like, just guessing and checking. But, yeah, I will, uh. Yeah, Sergeant Baker hasn't been well either, and he's losing weight. We're just having cat problems. Just, 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 uh. Cats are getting old. The viewers says sorry. I went into Discord and looked you out of Discord chat. Don't worry, it's push to talk. Just don't push the uh, little squiggle. Don't push the squiggle on your keyboard, Synemius, for your push to talk. It's so that I can chat with people in the Discord or uh, people can push to talk in and I can definitely hear you. Uh, I'm trying to make sure that our settings in the Discord, because as of right now, if you guys join the live Discord chat, and it is limited on who has access to it if you do want access to the live uh, chat let me know and i can uh send you an invite but it, it we're going to it's one of those you say something inappropriately and you're like removed from the community type of situations because you're going to be live um so it is kind of uh giving you guys a lot don't make me regret this so uh yeah if if for some reason those of you that i was chatting with when we did our live discord unboxing last week last wednesday um so most of you some of you i space there should be more of you with with access and privileges let me know Say something inappropriate, you say? Well, in the Discord chat, if you do, because you'd be live on my stream right now, if you say something inappropriate, I will be banning you from the community. So, like, there's that. It does weigh a little bit of, like, a, a hefty, hefty, but at the same point, then, like, hey, you're a friendo. I, I trust that, like, we are of the same mindset and moral mentality to know, like, our P's and Q's. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Before I jump into this muffin, so yeah, we're we're having an interesting, an interesting Monday. I've got stories to tell you though of Friday's wedding. 
don't get me wrong. Like, I've got stories to share. They have just been very much so clouded and put on the bench as, like, my mind is processing what needs to happen. Um, but I can't think of anything other than pineapple on pizza, milk, chocolate chip cookies for a semi-sweet chocolate chip. <laughs> I'd probably enjoy the semi-sweet. Be able to eat more. Would you rather have spaghetti for hair or sweet mayonnaise? Ew. Ew, Lafarage. Probably the spaghetti. Room Master, thank you so much for that three stream streak. I did see it come in. Uh, I read it, but just didn't say anything. Sorry, sorry. Uh, I feel you. I took my uh, five year old to find a dentist accepting. Yeah. Five years to find a dentist accepting new patients. Holy cow. It's just wild. It's just wild. And like you, I, 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 I can't get too upset because like I, I'm trying to look for somebody to give me a service, you know, like I'm trying to pay for services. You know, like I'm, I'm trying to find somebody to render services so I can, you know, like. Cat. <laughs> Needs a vet. The Renaissance Festival is upon us, Justin. Isn't it fall already? When's the first day of fall? When is the first day of fall? September 22nd. Oh my gosh, that is too long. I was hoping like it would be like, yeah, it's August 21st. Okay, sending positive advice. Yeah, yeah, just, 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 just some of those, some of those good tummy vibes stitches away. But yeah, well, I was just a uh, type brother. I, you can't join the voice? Oh, it's because it's very limited, Minion. Because we haven't been able to have this conversation. And you weren't there, Minion, last Discord to get the the unneeded to be to be vetted. I, I've shaken you down now. Uh, left, 100% case, 100% right. Oh, it's just my phone telling me about my earbuds that are in. Um, Minion, let me give you access, privilege, hold up. I've just got to we'll add somebody. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know what I'm doing. Give me a second. <laughs> Um, nope, you're already invited. I don't need to invite you to the community. I need to figure out how to get to the names of people. <laughs> oh, gosh. Server settings. So, anyways, you should be able to do this, right? You, you're a moderator. You should be able to, to give privileges, supposedly, to others. Right? Minion starts with an M, ends with an Inion. Starts with an Min, ends with an Yon. Min Yon. Got it. Found you. And then, where you can do this. You can't add rules. Interesting. All right. Well, hold on then. I got this. I just have to figure out where's the settings button. It's the sprocket in the corner. Uh, and then we're going to go to the roles button. And then we're going to go all the way down and to the live chats and to the permissions. Looks like I have the role already anyway. I'm just going to leave my phone in this section. You have the role, it just won't let you connect. Uh, <laughs> no worries, sis. I won't be able to chat anyway since mobile can't do PTT. Oh, uh, I don't know what that is. Oh, 
Oh, someone joined. Oh, you're muted. I should be able to unmute you. Unless you've muted yourself. Oh, you've muted yourself. Because then I'll be able to mute and do this. And I can push the chat. Because apparently Synemius only has the ability to push the chat too. <laughs> Mainly it's so that I don't hear you guys' really hefty keyboards. Oh, let me see here. Let me go permissions. Send messages. Read. Let's go to speak. If I, yeah, Bacon should be able to speak. Okay, so obviously I need to be on an actual computer. Uh, we're getting there, is all I'm saying. One step at a time, I'm figuring it out, Debonair. Welcome on in. But uh, yeah, so I do have Discord as a, let me see here. Should be good. Close up. Let me unhide all. We are gonna that one. Oh, let me Discord. Okay, now Discord has. I wonder if I no. Okay, so we're gonna leave the audio up for Discord. We won't have. We'll hide that. Okay, and then. We can pull this down. Sorry, we're playing with audio features right now, and my muffin is just sitting there staring at me. And then we should hide my dust. Yeah, I, uh, I, uh, I haven't really fumbled around with Discord on the uh, phone as much as I probably should. I did create a reactive image for Synemius for the Discord, but for some reason I can't get that to to work either. Yeah. And I think it has something to do with like me. Oh, see you. Okay. There's Minion. And if Minion were to say something, you would glow. Look it, I do. I do have friends. They're right there. Okay. So it is me that can't figure it out. Oh. Minion's supposed to be trying to talk. Wait, let me put the volume up on this. And I might also have it too where I've got to push something from my setting wise. Um, because there should be then one icon. Because I literally doodled up an image for, oh, you're using just your. All right. Uh, Synemius, I am going to completely uh, play with your. Uh, let's change your avatar. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm just going to upload an image. Don't worry, don't, don't worry about it. Um, I doodled it. It won't. Uh, I made it so it even talks too. Like, you guys would love this. Uh, Sinemius' avatar talks like the Canadians from South Park. <laughs> I couldn't get it to, uh, to work, though. Because I even have... Yeah, for some reason, reactive is not working. South Park. Yeah, he wanted to be a undead horde with a mohawk. Uh, and then I made it uh, talk. Oh, gosh. Okay, now let me see if I can figure Reactive. How come? What am I not doing wrong? Oh, I see. I see. I see you in the group. How come we're not in the group? Do I have to click on it? Oh my gosh, I had to click on it. So now you can see he's talking. <laughs> I can hear you. I'm still trying to figure it to make it so that Discord can hear you or so that everybody else can hear you. And I think I need to change volume too so that I can see you. Or hear you better. Question to chat. Could you guys hear Minion by chance? All right. 
So let me go here, user volume, pump them up to 100. Okay, so I think I need to then create my earphones as another output for them. Interesting. Get this. We'll figure it out. Oh, oh and then I can eat. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, hold up. I appreciate you assisting me with this. Okay, so always show include own and group. No, don't include own and group. And then I can come over here and we'll do this and we'll move this and I won't at all have to do all this again. Okay, and then I need to go back. I wish there was a way that in this live chat I could remove the push to talk function just for everybody's sanity. So let's see here, read history, uh, speak. Everybody should speak. So as long as I just said sounds, that's fine. Uh, I can't switch that feature here, can I? Dang it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Links, members. I wonder if that is something I can silence in the actual channel. Let's go back down to push to talk here. Uh, edit channel. User limit none. Category none. Hmm. That might have to be something that I like because I don't even have the the main computer downstairs. I join the voice channel. Oh, look it! And then even my little icon shows up down there. Yours is cooler than mine, Samaria. Um, but it looks like... Uh, so this is the opposite of last year's epiphone, where instead of a discount of the minute <laughs> You reverbed and came through even in uh, my phone. Oh, and then it double backed through to you guys. Ah, okay. So I definitely, I see. This will be so much easier with the soundboard downstairs. Interesting. Okay. So hold on. I am going to hang up out of this call so I don't keep uh, making a mess. Yeah. So there's, there's, but we're getting there. So this is, this is, this is my project for the rest of the month is, is to figure out a way to hang out with friends. Um, but as you could tell, we've, we've still got some areas to fix. <laughs> uh, and then if you guys want to know what I am using, there's the reactive link. Okay. And now I want to put, because if I could put all of the audio in through my headset, we won't have this issue. So let me see properties. No, I got nothing. Hold up. Do I have to put all of this? And through my headset. And then how do I turn them up? Through the app? Because I hear it in my ears. Sorry, there's like a headphone app as well for these things. How do I make my headphones louder? Not through the app. Not through the app, I think. Hmm. Something just quacked. I heard it. I don't know what it was, but I heard it. <laughs> I hear I hear quacking. I don't know why. Why is there quacking? And crickets now. Oh, it's Minion.
Ha ha. But if I'm hearing you through my headphones, that means everybody's hearing you. I think we got it. I think Chad can hear you. Softly. Okay. It's better than not at all. Baby steps, Debanan. Baby steps. All right. And then... Okay. We're, we're getting there. We're getting... Because this will also make going... If I can figure out... If I can figure this out and not just like plug and unplug and plug and plug, this would make going live in IRL a lot easier. Um, okay, so let's see here. I am going to... Is the music too loud? Question. Only nine days shy from 69. Music is fine. Okay. So it is the levels of everything else. All right. Let me go into uh, audio and vocals. And then I might just be able to pump you up to 200. And then... Uh, I think we can hear you. I think we can hear you just fine. Yes. Yeah, they should be able to hear you just fine. That's awesome. All right, so unfortunately, you won't be able to hear me through the Discord today um, because I didn't give Tallulah all the privileges to just talk. My bad, my bad. Now I know. Now I know. Um, have them sing a sea shanty song. <laughs> uh, but I will, and all of our friends should be able to hear you guys talk. So there's that. And if you'd like to join the live chat channel, I just, we have to be of the same understanding that we are live. So like no political speak, limit the cursing, you know, time and a place like there's got to be a reason but just don't don't say the bad words none of the bad words don't have the bad thoughts keep them to yourself <laughs> um but yeah huzzah we're, we're doing it yes and then if this is Sinenius, this little guy right here and if i push to talk him hi he just moves his mouth and it's so cool but this is what I was saying. Oh, and he's mirrored too for some reason. I can fix that. I need to turn this down and then turn desktop up as a whole. And then I need to go to the sound mixer board. And I found that it wasn't me that was mixing everything hot for Stream Raiders. When we come upstairs, it's this computer. <laughs> That's fine there. That is the OBS page. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Discord's good. My ear holes are good. Cool. I'm I'm very thrilled that this is is working. <laughs> huh. And I could just change and, and wiggle and, and move things around. Wonderful. Okay. 
yeah, I like that, that the project took me kind of out of my own headspace. So that worked out well. We do have a Stream Raiders battle going on. Matt Scott, welcome on in. Oh, Debonair Corvus, thank you again for that 60 months of resobbing. Hopping out, cause work. No, completely makes sense. Completely makes sense. <laughs> uh, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, Minion. Alstrom, so I think I should then be able to take one ear butt out, charge it, Sinemius was saying. But this will also let me know too if I hear the cats downstairs and they need something. Yeah, Puck was like, what? I get to eat two? Two foods? Yeah. Cool. Discord's good. We got we got it good to go down here. Or upstairs. Mm-hmm. Hmm. So how was your guys' weekend before I tell you about the Friday wedding? What did you guys get up to this weekend? Now, pardon me. For those of you that were here for Wednesday, Wednesday's Discord shenanigans, I will say we're not trying to get partnered with Discord by any means. No, 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 no. I just want to interact with my friends and community more, and I feel like Discord is the appropriate platform in which to implement a merger of activities it's already there we might as well use it if we're already on it um but no i i the discord to be partnered with discord you gotta like open it up to the community community i don't want to deal with other people i just want to deal with my people <laughs> waking was pretty good my cousin and his son came down to visit took me out of the brewery you played two, 7D, 2D all weekend. 7D, 2D. You were stuck back-to-back uh, -back meetings for uh, five hours. And it was miserable. Oh. Back-to-back -back meetings, especially for five hours. At least they gave you a bathroom break by the sounds of it. Seven days to die. Thank you kindly. I did not get that acronym. Um, seven days to die. Definitely there's coconut. For those of, for the Discord stream, definitely there's coconut. <laughs> what a blowhole, coconut. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. New to him, Mustang. I like, you know what? There's just something about getting a new vehicle. Even if it's just new to you. Oh! Sinemius, you're gonna hate me because all I can think about is El Camino Ranchero. We saw a beautiful, like, purple. It reminded me, well, it had Cobra tires. It's a Ford make anyways. You know that Cobra Mustang purple with, like, the glitter when it catches it? Like, if it's a dark day, it could pass as, like, a slightly not as dark black or... But like, and when the sun hits it, by some like angles, you're blinded by the flakes of glitter. And it's just that luscious, like royal purple. So clear. You think that they, they, you know, one of those people who put the resin on the cups made it type of smooth. Oh, we saw a ranchero. I'm an El Camino gal, but like, you got to respect the front end of a ranchero. That is, see, I was like, wow, look at the front. I go. That's definitely not an El Camino. Look at the front of that car. It's just, it's, it is, as some people inappropriate use the the front word, it just looks nasty. It looks so good. Nasty is a good thing. That's, that's what people don't understand. When you say nasty, that's a good thing. Ooh, she, that nasty. That, oh, it was, it was. And the older lady that was driving it, she must have been in her 60s, 70s was just like, yeah, my son was saying, you know, it needs to go to the car show. She goes, I want other people touching my car. And I was like, it's gonna be me with my 96 truck when I'm your age, lady. I don't want other people touching my car. 
It's meant to be driven. <laughs> so, uh, so there was that. Oop, I think I turned the music off. Oop, I think I turned it back on. Sorry, I pushed, I pushed, I gotta make sure that when I go to put the ear butts in, I go from the outside, not just shove the finger inward. Oh. The real deep metallic blue. I had a boyfriend in high school who had a Cobra Mustang. Uh, got it from a police auction in Pontiac. And uh, it was it was that purple. And that's the only way that I'm familiar with that purple is because like, it's not the first time I've seen that color purple. You know. That douchey high school boyfriend that every every girl in wonderfully decides to endure. <laughs> yeah. You look back at some of them and you're like, ma'am, he was a real douche canoe. <laughs> if only I knew the phrase then. Oh. But yeah, I saw. We were. We were on the way to the wedding on Friday when we saw the ranchero. I uh, did don my wedding, not not my wedding dress, but like the dress that I wear to weddings or that I've been wearing to weddings for like the past three years. If it's not broke, don't fix it. If it's a good dress, it doesn't matter if you're going to, you know, the friend of a friend who's been to the other friend's wedding, who's seen you in the dress. You might even have group photos with them. It doesn't matter. Remember, we were told that it was outside not to wear black. It was going to be like a floral wedding. So I brought out the floral wedding dress. <laughs> it just so happens that the dress she, she wears to weddings that has, you know, the hat that matches because we had to trim off four inches and I just tied it around the top of a hat for it. Uh, Wore, wore, wore that dress. Hilarious. I had some encounters. And you know what, Sinemius? I don't know their names. And I'm gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna even, I, I'm gonna, uh, so there was a family member of, uh, I'm gonna take it, of uh, the bride's who decided to don a fedora the whole entire day. And I don't know if they've just never interacted with the opposite sex before, because that's what they exhibited, even though they were maybe 20 years older than me. Because uh, after the ceremony, first off, had a wonderful adult time hanging out with my tall, my little, my younger, taller brother with a little bit yeah he's got a during the summer he really just gets that darker complexion he like takes the any ankling no i i think i'm hairier than him i think that's the only like oh this you do have a little bit of armenian in you because you're a hairy beast you're just very lucky that it's blonde uh because my brother he just he gets so beautifully olive like his skin just it all tans just so nicely. Not not an inkling. Like, you don't look at all look at him and go, oh, is he related to lobsters? Like, I spend five minutes in the sun without, you know, some sunblock on the nose, the shoulders, the ears, underneath the soles of my feet type of situation. And I look like I straight just Sebastian's sister from The Little Mermaid. And uh, so... <laughs> We were we had a great time. It was my uh, my younger brother, his wife. Uh, his wife is the same age as me, and she wonderfully managed to stay mute as my brother literally was just throwing the age daggers at me. Oh, so you mean like twenty five years ago? Oh, so like thirty years ago? And I'm like, hold up! You realize your wife is the same age as me. You cannot date me as the crypt keeper in your stories without looking next to you and being, and, and she's just like slinking back into the, uh, the pews. 
Uh, we were in the middle of nowhere. So when I say pews, like, I mean, like, the little slab of wood that was in the back. Uh, we sat in the back thinking, like, oh, goodness, Debonair, if we sit in the back, like, it's going to be perfect. Nobody's going to see us. No, wrong. We s went sitting in the back. What we didn't take into account meant that as the bride and every single one of the bridal party members had to pass right by us. We were actually the first faces that every single one of them saw to the point that Sister Law looks over at me and she goes, are you smiling like this? Because you know that you're going to be in every single one of these photos. And I looked at her and I go, fuck yeah, I am. <laughs> like, you don't understand. I know ex I, yes, we, unfortunately, the, the row that you two chose for us to sit in, we are going to be in every single one of these photos. So yes, put on your best smile. Do you need some Vaseline? Do you need some chapstick? Put it on those front teeth there because we are going to be in them all. Leave the poo poo face at the door. <laughs> we, and so, like, literally, every person. <laughs> uh, they had something that I have never seen before. I think every wedding should do it. And then I also realized, too, that I'm getting older than that I thought. I was like, oh, look at these youthful spirits. This is hilarious. This is so cute. And I was like, oh, all right. So we are aging ourselves with our response here. They had something raptor called flower boys. No, they were not children. Yes, it was two adults in, like, their 20s. Two, like, like the groom was probably in a fraternity, had some like extra friends that really wanted to be a part, but like being a bride, she just didn't have that many girlfriends because the older us females get, we weed out the weak. And when I say weak, I mean like we weed out the ones who just shit on us behind our back and we're like, girl, we, I really do not need to put up with your bullshit as I get older. I am not gonna donate any of my gray hairs to this. Bye bye. Uh, <laughs> we we bye bitch a whole lot of uh of our friends, friendly acquaintances as we get older. Uh, to you know just just tighten the knit of the tribe. Uh, so like obviously the groom had a couple more friends that he wanted to be a part of the wedding. Um, flower boys. What did these two gentlemen do? Not only did they come in with some swagger, they had their big ba bushels full of flowers, and they. They got to the start of the aisle. They spoke, they practiced. I think they practiced more than the rest of the bridal party, including the bride and groom. They struck like poses and just flower petals. And I have to say thank you gentlemen for being like, oh my goodness, that girl in the back that we made eye contact with, we're not sure if she's over the age of 21. We can't give her a high noon. They were flipping and slinging and handing high noons around and throwing the petals. I'm just saying, flower boys. If I, if it was life or death and they said, Dis, you have to put on a traditional wedding this time around. And I was like, Sinemius, I if we don't do the traditional wedding, we're going to have to jump off a cliff. And like, we looked at the cliff below and we're like, ah. It can't be that bad, right? Like, it can't, it can't. Let's, let's, let's try to put on a shindig for the family. Flower boys would be how I would kick it off because that was that was a wonderful, a wonderful pop off, a wonderful send off to uh, my sister, my stepsister walking down the uh, the aisle. Like that was that was fantastic. That was fantastic. I'd never seen anything like that. Uh oh. But yeah, flower boys. Who the fuck? Um, Father Dis is is getting old. Uh, it was a good time. It was a good time. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tell all of the. I'm not gonna air out all of the family dirty laundry that happened at the uh, the wedding. Um, all I gotta say, Mama Dis, you good. You, you don't, girl, you looking, you looking fly over on your side of this. You, you, you do, I can't wait to go to Ikea and go to Buddy's Pizza with you for your birthday, uh, next weekend. 
But girl, you good. You good. You you stay you stay classy, Mama Diz. You good. Uh yeah, it, it's just so like it's, you know, uh after the wedding, we went for like cocktails, snacks, they had a security table, and uh I got down on that charcuterie table. I was hungry. <laughs> we tried to go to a brewery to get food ahead of time, but apparently the cherry and bourbon pot stickers sounded very much so like a deep fried cheese curds that uh, we got deep fried apparently cheese curds instead of the pot stickers. So I could not partake. One of the reasons I never a weenie around my older sister shouldn't have stayed to whip out a baby rafter is cheeks right. I guess so many stories. So many stories. Uh, so many stories for, for, uh, for my younger, taller brother. But I have even, I'm just, the reason it had, people, were, Mama Dis was like, oh, you, you had, it, there was no issues? I go, you don't understand. I put on the dress I wear to weddings, but this purse, it's got an arsenal of stories that nobody wants me to open up because I don't think I'm going to be able to fold them all back in there neatly. <laughs> and she goes, she looked at me like I go, oh, what's somebody going to say? Because I'm sure that there is something to, I got something for that. <laughs> uh, She's like, okay, okay, you had it. She goes, you had a good time. I was like, yeah, we had a really good time. Uh, let me show you without doxing myself. Let me remove all of my media. Uh, so here is a photo of Sinemius and I. From uh, the, we went to Ludington, which is on the far west side. Very, very bougie. There's a big old boat, the Badger. Um, but yeah, so glad I brought a shawl. She was breezy. She was breezy. Uh, oh, okay. Let me, I do, I do. I just want to go and we've got 20 minutes left on, on uh, this. I'm going to go and just make sure that Stitch is okay. Make sure that there's no uh, vomit to clean up. I'll actually take you guys fully with me. I can take you speaker mode and uh, headpiece mode. We don't need to take a full break. I can hydrate. I don't have to use the restroom, but let's go check on the old man. I don't, I've uh, kept one uh, of the headphones out for those of you that have had the privilege of being a cat guardian. You'd know that the sound of cat vomiting will wake you up out of a dead sleep. So I'm just making sure we don't have any cat puke on the carpet. You okay, buddy? We come down to check on you, me and chat. I brought chat too. How are you? you? You haven't moved. You're still in your same spot. You purring? Okay. You okay, buddy? We give you head kisses. Okay. Just wanted to make sure that you were okay. Can I, can I pick you up and take you out to the water? I just want to make sure that if you're thirsty or hungry that you're, you're getting your foods. And you're not just lazily sleeping. So hold on, let me, you can always walk right back to bed. You can always walk right, he let me pick him up. So I know his tummy doesn't hurt, 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 hurt. Do you want a little bit more of your churu? Look at, there's still a little churu left. No, no more churu? What about some water? Yes to the churu? Yay to the other half of the churu on the plate. All right, buddy. Yeah, eat it up, eat it up. I just picked the chicken one of the churros. I didn't want to go like any funky flavors. Right? It's like the chicken noodle soup for kitty cats. Yeah, I'm glad you ate the rest of the churro. Get some water. Get some water for your tummy. Water is good. Water is easy to, to pukey puke. Yeah, get some water, buddy. Did you want me to get you new water? Here, I'll, I'll get new water. We'll get new water. We'll get new water for you. There, maybe there's something that's water. God. Then gross in there. Sorry, I'm in there. Okay. 
Water is gross, so we'll get you Brita water, because you bougie cats. You need some Brita water? <laughs> no, you want the water from the flower? Yeah, I'd want the comical version, too. Okay, Stitches. No puke. Fine. No, five. I'm going to make the note that he did eat the other half of Churu and is drinking water. Uh, H2O plus the second half of Churu at 11. Cool. All right. You can go back to bed if you want to. I'm sorry for waking you. Yeah, I'm glad that you're talking. You weren't even talking to me this morning. Yeah, okay. Well, take it easy, okay, buddy? Keep drinking the water. Oh, oh I turn a fan on. Coming back upstairs to the art studio, I'm like, oh, man, it's a little warmer. It's a little warmer. All right. So I went and checked on, on the old man kitty cat. The clean plate club. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, it's now clean. It's now, it's, he's now got the clean plate club. Um, but yeah. Okay. Cat was checked on. We're good there. Um, whew. Okie dokie. Now, getting back to things. The Discord. I am hanging out in the live chat section. We're gonna do some art today. We're gonna do some uh, some screen printing. I am in the process. After we make these uh, these screen printing things, I have thought it is time uh, to figure out packing and shipping and how much things uh, how plausible keeping things on a low cost for the bookmarks to be shipped and be merch. In a perfect world, I'd add these to the merch store. So like I was looking up rigid mailers, seven by nine, the do not cut stickers because like talking to friends, they're like, you wanna make sure that you've noted on your package to so like not cut it with the, you know, a box cutter. And I was like, well, shouldn't people know that? And she goes, you never assume people know that. She goes, do you not remember the McDonald's coffee, it's hot lawsuit. And I go, gotcha. <laughs> Copy. Uh, and then uh, bubble wrap too, uh, like, you know, to make sure that things stay nice and tidy. So yeah, I, I think uh, for all of the posting materials, in excluding the postage stamps, like all of the materials to package one to three, <laughs> Uh, so like to package up one bookmark for, for sales, the packaging materials per bookmark would be 56, 57 cents. It's completely doable. I want to try to make sure that everything that I'm doing keeps the cost down. Cause if I can keep the production costs on and the materials cost down, that just makes it then, you know, an even more affordable and cheaper piece of art for others. Like that's what I'm, I'm trying to do. Remember a different hot coffee lawsuit. I just thought of oh, the, the lady with the hot coffee that spilled under her leg and burned her. Like, I'm sure that hurts. That's, I, but like, you should have known that the coffee was hot. Like, I, I mean, you got hot coffee. Uh, -uh. but there's also, you know, so yeah, that's, that's what I've been doing. Uh, with multiple bookmarks, so I don't know how many bookmarks without getting the rigid mailers in hand I will be able to safely package inside of them, but I do know that we could at least do minimum one as of right now without knowing max would be two, and that would only be adding a seven cents more for packaging because all it would do would be adding more bubble wrap to the second item to make sure that it doesn't get crushed, but yeah. They were sued because it was too hot. And the McDonald's have been told that multiple times. I got you. I got you. But now it says hot on the cups. I'm surprised they didn't have those ahead of time. So I just have to make sure that I put esoteric. Don't you whip out that box cutter like you're going to wheel and deal slice and dice these, you know, little packages up if there's like a piece of paper inside that you don't want. I'm 
type of thing. So yeah, that's 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 what I was. Uh, and then like to make them, the cellophane and the laminate is the only thing that is the same that's uniform. And then I use all the other materials, whether I buy them or I source them from things that I already have in my studio. I get it. Just feel bad for the poor. Oh, I do too. She was an elderly lady. It was like on her thigh or her leg. Like, oh my goodness. If that would have happened to my grandmother, I would have felt so bad. But at the same time too, like, put it in a cup holder. She gonna be hot. Like, yeah, there's, there's, just, there's just a lot of things that like, now we preacted before we reacted, but yeah, oh. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. I just keep thinking, like, oh man, if that was my grandma, but like, it was supposed to be hot. Warnings and regulations like that are always reactions, you see? Yep. Yeah. Like, uh, I, probably something bad happened before they had to put the do not take your blow dryer into the bathtub with you situation. Like, why do they have that particular image on the blow dryer tags? Probably because I, I mean I I'm just hypothesizing, but like probably because there was a, an unfortunate accident that happened that involved a blow dryer inside a bathtub. But that is the distinct image that we get on them is like don't take your blow dryer into the bathtub, and you're like, so the sink's okay? Just just the, just the tub. Hugs is a little too tight. And I uh, to her. How you doing? Uh, no, I'm chaotic. I'm, uh, I'm doing well. We need to send all the hugs to Stitches, though. He's, he's not, uh, he's, 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 he's having, he's, he's got, he's this little, he's got a little, he's a little, a little under the weather kitty. Um, so, under, under the weather kitty. We'll take a break at noon, and then I will, uh, we'll take like a, 10 minute break at noon and I'm going to call a bunch more vets to see if I can find one that's accepting patients again. There are a bunch of other vets in the state. Goodness gracious, some people. Most people don't sit or stand in the sink while using a blow dryer. They do in the bathtub? That's just not the place that I would think to. My hair is what? I want it to be dry. And then what I do need uh, to add to this section is our reactive friends. Where are you guys? Where's our Discord? We're gonna copy. Head over here. And then we're gonna paste. Then I'm going to bring this back all the way. Yes. And then I'm going to move them here. All right. Uh, sorry, I was playing with everything. So there should, there's a lot of random stuff that was triggered. A lot of random stuff that was triggered. And I think the way that the table is set up. I have a section that I can use. My tissue, my phone. Actually, put the phone right there. Oh, I got a message. I mean, I guess worst case scenario, I just call the um, the old vet from Detroit, from South Detroit. Just as this, you'd be so proud of me. I'm learning how to bone corset with zip ties. Be careful with your zip ties too. Make sure that you still sand the edges because I've seen uh, even zip ties poke through the tops of people's corsets. But nice. We do a lot. We do a lot of boning on this channel too. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny. Do, 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 we do a lot of boning on this channel as well. Oh, look at Owie. Just uh, she's like, look at I'm I'm on the actual tabletop this time around. Obligated. Obligated. 
obligatory phrasing. All right, I need to turn, sorry, I was playing with the desktop audio and I kerbuffled that one. So what is this one for? This is for OBS, this, and this is what I need. But Stream Raiders was all I wanted to take down. All right, and then I need to do, I'm working on this, working on this. All right, so TTS comes through up here in my audio. And I do TTS through. Do, do, do. There it is. Let's go to dashboard. Yep, the login in. Yeah, we're authorizing. Just want to turn TTS up a bit. Redirect me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me, uh, extension. Next. Back. Oh, okay. Fine, fine, fine. TTS limit. Okay, where is my TTS settings? Yum, boink. Your upgrades. I don't need to, my preferences. We might have to get a new TTS. Ugh. I haven't been into our TTS bot in a minute. Edit features. Volume is already at 100. Okay. then I guess I would have to take this, bring that down. <coughs> pardon, pardon. Can you guys still hear the music by chance? Uh, I'm using a rubber navy cap that you use for Shelving the hardware store is my toilet. Oh, yeah, that'll work. Uh, have you ever thought about selling hoodies and t-shirts with your trademark logo? I have. I just have to finish. We have... <laughs> Nesca, we have. Uh, it's going to just be a black t-shirt with uh, one white on top. It will have our logo and say Disfusional, but the back is already just designed to... Uh, what I've been waiting to do is when releasing the t-shirts, and I already know the company too, and I've already talked to the company too, uh, is I wanted to release a, a sticker to go along with it, uh, but the sticker would be in color, and we haven't finished that yet. You know what, time just kind of gets away from us, and then somebody needs us to make a costume, and then we've got a guest appearance here or there. That's why, like, I'm... I'm just, I'm, I'm learning to just outsource things to people, but then I'm also forgetting to follow up with them as I'm talking this right now, and I'm realizing that I never got back to the emote people after TennoCon. That is something I need to do as well. Um, just reach back out uh, to be like, we are ready for those emart artists. Uh, it got to the point like they wanted more information, and I was like, I need to, I need to pause for a second. I, I got a whole lot of this to work on that I mentally was like, I'm, I'm at capacity. <laughs> let's we'll sort of figure this out uh, but yeah 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 all right i'm gonna bring that down just a bit i think without getting myself into too much 
trouble. If I, if you guys are looking for an arm for an overhead mount, I really dig this newer one that I got. It is very versatile. All right, hold on. I need to double check that I'm not putting this arm into our our chatting cam. But yes, 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 yes. I've even I've 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 got the means. I just I've got a I've got a time is uh, a thing that I run out of. <laughs> Someday. Someday. And like, I, I like to make sure that I get quality check over everything. So like outsourcing it to a third party just is, is just not me. It's just not me. Now I know you guys can see it here, but like that's, that's fine. It's behind the chat anyways. But this should then put you guys closer to the artwork. And that's what we want. But yes, 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 yes. See a lot of creators doing that uh, to expand their channel. Um, I, uh, but there, a lot of them are doing it where it's, they're paying a company to do all of that. I would get the quality products in here and I would have, they would be shipped from me to you. That way I can make sure they're good to go. That way I can package them with the extra sticker. Um, yeah, that stuff. But yes, I have, I have thought about it. Um, Cause then I'd also need them on hand for when I do my guest appearances at conventions too. That's why in the discord I did take down an inquiry for sizes for like what sizes would my community want because with my initial uh first order run with the ann arbor t-shirt co uh, i need to have a certain quantity and i can pick out how many of you know larges extra larges two x's three x's smalls mediums i want but you know you'd, you'd want to make sure that people want those sizes so we did uh field engage let's see when did we start working on the t-shirt design here i'm gonna unfortunately throw myself under the bus let's see here polls we had started working on the t-shirt design and just had not finished it oh gosh in 2022 in august of 2022 so it's almost been two two years shit okay giving myself a new goal let's color that stupid uh back art Let's cover that silly back art. Because <sighs> um, let's see here. I can even show you through the camera that we have here what it looks like in the Discord for all the ideas. I'm almost certain. If I go scroll up past the thumpers that I buried underneath a pile of cosplay items. Here it is, here. So here is... If you go to the Discord, you can get a better image of it or a better photo of it. But there it is. So it is a like hat. It's got the little cat, mouse, and paw prints. <laughs> it's got a <laughs> welcome on in, Thomas. My uh, first pair of sewing scissors, some paint, my IEMs, our microphone, uh, and we did finish it up with some cables. It's got some sewing needles. Uh, and then it would say, it says underneath it, it says creatively unfold your imagination with my website link. Uh, and then the front is just real clean. It's just the logo with the uh, square box on the front. Uh, and I don't know if I want to put Disfusional Studios underneath that or just like leave it clean with just like a logo. Uh, we'll, we'll figure that out. But there's, gotta, I got to hatch out some things. I got I to do some things. Color some things. Color some things. Okay, hold on. My uh, my nose is running. It's finally catching up. Pardon me. I'm just gonna turn around. Okay. Oh. 
Ow, that hurt. <laughs> Good morning, fire shade. <laughs> My knee hit a uh, footstool that I had on top of another footstool because I thought I was being clever. Ow. Okay. Okay. But yes, Anemius, I also had called the vet that you sent me a message for. They, they were my first call. They were the first to tell me that they weren't accepting you people. Yeah. All right. So what do we have here? Today, we are going to be working on our screen printing. We kind of already went over this, uh, started this, rather couple months ago right couple couple months ago uh, it looks like I've already drawn them out on the uh, the paper that's okay um, and what I'm gonna block print the white block print the silver I just have to figure out where those are, where those areas are going to be. Okay. So we got to block print everything. So we're going to block print white, block print silver, and then do the, the uh, screen printing of screen. For this, I am going to, on red, block print white for screen printing of black. For this lady, I don't think I'm doing anything. I don't, I don't, I don't, because it's, do we block print then the mask? No. What well, is going to be? Uh, we could. We could block print the mask. Let me see if I can get you guys a little closer without bringing you guys down. Because I think you're already in camera view here. Oh, no, you're literally just... Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Let me see if I can zoom you guys in a little bit. Uh, zoom? A little more? No? No? That's all I got? Well, okay. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> okay, could be worse. I got autofocus turned off. Nice. Oh, good morning, Fireshade. So I'm trying to decide. I've got the color paper for a bunch of them already figured out for dog on rampa i have red for the huntress we've got a navy blue for scream i've got sea green <laughs> um we do have tassels that will go with the huntress. I've got little pieces of wood I thought maybe to uh, go with them, but I've, then I did find some axes. And you guys had told me that we needed two axes then per. So we do have the dual wielding little axes for Dagon Rampa's Monokuma, we are going to make the ties that go with them, just a split of the color, the red and the black color, because I do have the Cricut material then that we'll iron on to these, and it'll be a real simple tie. For Scream, I've got bloody knives, plastic knives, and cell phones. Yep, so we will uh, 
Put some plastic knives and some cell phones on there. One cell phone and a knife per card. And this will be done. I've just got some some black cord. I've got two two black cords. It'll probably be done with this stuff, the thinner, the thinner black cord that was also used then for our jean stamps with call. Now I do plan on also making a death note. Uh, bookmark just using black and blocks uh, so I do have little apples got some got some apples first things first though I guess is uh, to block print out everything that we're gonna need so let's put all the extras away A little extra fittings we won't need those until the end Won't need any of this until the end. We'll need that stuff, so we'll leave that out. We will be printing more than we end up using. A lot of the ones that we end up printing just get recycled. Bad prints, it happens. So what I am going to need to do is to create a a block. a template to use so that I know where I'm going to be block printing. And something still makes me think that maybe, chat, I should block, create a block of the rabbit's face. Leave the axis as is, because we're going to be putting the ax hanging down. Easy to do in a CNC machine. Yeah, but there's something about, you know, just carving in the rubber or laser cutters. But I've already got, I've already got these done. You're saying just to laser cut all the bookmarks instead of screen printing, but then you, you lose that traditional art aspect of them. And that's what we want to do. It's the more hands-on traditional art method. Gosh. You know, to have those imperfections where things are, cut the actual printing blocks. Oh, probably, probably. But it didn't take us that long to cut these. It didn't take us that long to cut them. But I wonder, do we uh, do a mask? I think we should. Something makes me think we should. on the navy blue that way we can put the blood splatter on it don't worry about the axis because we're going to be putting Oof. uh from a handmade art with all the impressions repeatable would be cool but i could do things like break out the face mask as a duplicate uh as a duplicate what is with the... Oh, so what it must be is it must be that Blurp has already got one of those. So they add letters. This is the same thing as Cinemia says. I don't know. Yeah, because I still have to go over top of these with the drawing medium, the drawing mask, and then block in the rest of the screens. So, like, everything that is black, I will want to keep black. And then everything that is white, I will put my masking medium down on. Or, no, it's the other way around. Forgive me. Everything that's black, I'm going to put my drawing fluid on. And then everything else that is white is going to get my masking fluid on. That way, when that washes away. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That's what I wanted to do. <laughs> she thought about it wrong. That would have been funny, right? That would have been hilarious. That would have been hilarious. So, uh, yeah, a little, a little block printing. I guess we can put masking fluid, let it dry. Yeah. To just do the masks, the mask. I'm trying to like envision it in my brain right now.
Yeah, I think we will. I think we will. So I'm going to get my carving tools out. Whoop. I don't think, I think that's going to be too big. What are these? Oh, these are my dragon made and my, my logo. That's funny. That's funny. Okay, but also, where is my cutting tool? Oh, it's in the bottom here. Pardon me. Excuse me. Squeeze me. Thank you. Thank you, sir. What is this? Sorry, it's got like extra things. Every single time I open up something, I find new things. It's like a linoleum cutter from what? What year? Look at this. It's like a no linoleum cutter, but like... It doesn't have a year on it. Speedball. Speedball, when was your logo like this? Here we go, here we go. Put it in the actual, oop, this way. Interesting. Interesting, there's no year on it. Mm. I don't think Steve has changed their packaging in like 40 years. Yeah, it was, look, she looks like an old guy, a little, an old one. Let's see here. Uh, speed ball logos. History. History. We need the history part. Oh. Bad uh, letter form, archive speedball, textbook with pen and brush lettering the, from the 1960s. First published, it's anywhere from 19... Oh shoot, I have this book. Hold up, I have this book. I, I know I have that book. I've se I, I literally flipped through that book. Where did I where did I put the screen printing book? Give me one second. She's got to go through her 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 archive. I have that book. I know I have that book. I very much so know I have that book. Where did I put that book? Sorry, I'm just rummaging through my art books right now. Found it. I do have the book. See, I I knew I had that book. I'm uh, I'm looking at it right now. It says this is the 19th edition from 1965. Yeah, this is not the 19th edition. Oh, look at, look at the sticker of authenticity. It only costs $1.50. Uh, 1960, 1965. So, uh, this, that package could be as old as 1915 or as late as 1965, they say. Interesting. Okay, and there's little notes in the corner too from. Oh, so cool. Just practicing your calligraphy. Too funny. How cool. Oh, just, just finding old books. Just finding an old book with an old logo on it. Hmm. Good stuff. Good stuff. Must have been all and something else. Oh, shit. <laughs> not cocaine. We're not talking about cocaine. Silly, silly, silly. I thought it meant something else. <laughs> Too funny. All right, I'm going to scoot this out of the way, question mark. Yeah, well, that's that's why I said, like, it could, it could, they first introduced that logo in, like, 19, like, the 50, whatever, and that book, which was, like, one of the last ones where the logo was, like, 65. 
So I just figured it was somewhere in there. But it did look like it was an older version than that. I would maybe place it with the 40s. Like I don't, I don't think that there was anything engraved on the outside of the box besides linoleum cutter. Yeah, it doesn't have a year or anything. Yeah, no year on anything. Not on the underside of the box or anything. Nope. Hmm. Nope. Your guess is as good as mine. Oh, what was that? Discord. What's Discord got going on? What's Discord got going on? We are going to old school then. I don't think. Oh, I was so close. I was like, I don't think the mask is going to fit. If only you could like cut and glue these together. Because that does not fit. Now I'm not worried about it. We use the uh, inexpensive linoleum blocks for this stuff. Especially when we're just using for projects like this. We don't need any of the fancy stuff. So don't need no fancy stuff. So all I'm going to do is take the back of here with a pencil. I got my Ticonderoga and I am going to put some graphite on the outside perimeter. I don't have to worry about any of the detail because that will be screen printed on. I just want the base outline of the mask and then I am going to put this there. Hold it down. I'm going to then get a mechanical pencil just for its sharp and I am going to go around the outside. Do, 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 do. Nope. Apparently the lead does not want to stay out. Wow. Okay. Well, Hopefully then just the plastic nubbin will be enough. And if I make any errors, I can just lightly take a damp paper cloth to wipe it off. Do do. Huzzah! It's kind of like what I wanted. Kind of. Kind of. Sort of. Kind of. Sort of. All right. And then I am going to just trace it again with a pencil. Make sure I got everything. I definitely want to double check what the heck happened up here. Yeah, erasing is not the, the best choice, but whoops. It looks like things got really muddy. Things got really muddy. I want to redo that. I'm gonna go and get a white uh, hand stuck in the jar. Bring out the water. Mm -mm -mm.
Just trying to uh, clean up my lines. Wet hands, wet hands, wet hands. Get all the little fuzzies off of it. And we'll give it another shot. We'll just drop it down. Now that we've got the lead out, we should have a better outline, supposedly. Did we get a better line? Well, kind of. I can't really even tell. Did that even do anything? Did that even transfer? Is that line already gone? It's already gone. Are you kidding me? Pencil, pencil. Graphite, old school. You're failing me. Okay, we're going to erase it all then. I'll flip it. And I am just going to then... Graphite around the area. And maybe it'll transfer that way instead. Because that was different. Mm -hmm. We're just going to make sure that we use the same old area. And then I should just be able to rub it. Okay, that worked out better. I had to be smarter than what I'm working with. I wasn't at first. So now I'm going to trace my outside edge. Mm -hmm. Again, we do have the Discord live chat open. If anybody wants to uh, pop in and say hello. Let's get a knife out and a ruler. I'll get a small ruler. It should be fine. A small guy. Hello, Eden Obi. I hope you're having a good day. Welcome on in. Just lining this up. This will be what? Oh. Chat. I'm a doofus. How long have we been doing this for? Years. Decades. But apparently, this is my first time at the rodeo because I decided to draw it out in its normal view and it should be reversed. Well. <laughs> 
change plans. So I'm gonna do <laughs> Thomas is like, all I would have had to have done is push a button and it would have flipped it for me. My button is telling me I need to uh, add some graphite to the outside again. Too funny. Yeah, well, maybe your, uh, your guys' way would have been a little faster. Technology. All right, let's see. Only if it's already programmed that way. Uh oh. You're like, I could have just mirrored that with the push of a button, Dis, you silly, silly troll. I will in three minutes. I will in three minutes. It's almost noon. Yeah, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make some lunch. I'm gonna check on Stitch. And that did not transfer. Yeah. I gotta check on him. I gotta check on a baby. I gotta check on my baby. Okay, that didn't work as well as it did the first time. Go figure. Yeah, I checked and noted that he ate, and I, he did, I did watch him drink water. I uh, pulled him out of the bed where he was napping to see if I could get him to eat the second half of the chewer that I had squeezed out onto a plate for him. He did snack on that, so that's... that's... Come on, Stitch. You're you're the king of snacks. You're our king snacker. We we need you to feel better, buddy. All right, got it in the other direction. Let's use a sharpie for this one. Yeah, I figured uh, we'll be able to get this doodled out, and then we'll go check on, check on little kitty cat. And then I'm going to, this this next break, we're going to do a 10 minute break. I'm going to uh, make some lunch and then I'll bring my lunch up here to eat with you guys. But I'm also going to uh, try to make a couple more phone calls. I'm going to Google some more events in the uh the state and uh see if we can get him in see if we can get him in to a place he needs to get his updated rabies shot too not that he goes outside but you know so that he can continue to bite people and it's okay so I, uh, it, the Sharpie, the, the bolder black line is the one that we're going to be using. So like this is going to be cut away. This is cut away. We'll put little X's all over everything so that we know. That way when I go to stamp it down, it'll be in the correct. So yeah. Put little X's now around everything that we're going to be cutting away. And we will carve this out. When we get back, I'm going to clean up one mess before we start another. Look at me, Mom. Where 
did I put? Where did I put that? Oh, now I'm really spacing out. Hmm. I must have put it in the till then. Okay, that's fine. Sorry, I was just uh, thinking of something else. My bad. All right. So when we come back, we will. I even have, we don't need that. We don't, we, we don't. let's be real. That's a little excessive. I was gonna pull up my, uh, my, my, my block carving stop, but we'll just use, we'll use just, you know, normal. <laughs> pull out the hole, oh, we'll put the knife away. That's a good thing to do. I don't think that's a new blade. That's definitely not a new blade. It's got resin all over it. What is this one? That's missing the tip, so cool. All right, we'll leave this. We've got this. We'll leave this. We'll put those in there for now. All right, friends, I am going to take... Oh, I think I forgot about Stream Raiders as well. Also, do some of your uh, own bookmark. Yeah, I also do some of my own bookmarks, although I just illustrate them, but you're screen printing them, that's interesting. Yeah, we've done a couple of uh, screen printed bookmarks in the past. You're going to see them in the traditional art section of our website under portfolios. If you go to traditional art, you should see some of the past ones like our call, the Tubi, and Denji. Uh, but yeah. Back again into the mana. Yeah, we are. We're upstairs in the art studio. Only stitch though. Well, stitch is, stitch is the one that doesn't feel good. Puck's fine. Puck, Puck likes it. Puck's like, I got two plates of wet food. He didn't want to eat his. You can't put it away. So like, like stitch is, uh, stitch is doing well. Stitch is having, stitch is having a good time. Or so, not stitch, sorry. Puck's, Puck's, Puck's having a good time. Puck is, uh, eating twice as much uh, wet food. He's like, this is great. This is great. Little brother, sh big brother should be sick more often. No raid. Oh, we're not raiding. We're not done yet. I'm going to take a quick lunch break. Check on the cats. Call some vets. Fingers crossed. Call some vets. Not accepting new clients until the fall. But like multiple places. Weird. Just like take my money. Take my, admit my cat, please. First time you'd need to go in for like diagnostics and things like that. He is peeing. He's just not, you know, going number two. So, like, fecal sample I can't produce unless he produces. Uh, but, all right. I'm going to take a quick five-minute break. Or, sorry, ten-minute break, my friends. We're on ten minutes. I'm going to call some more place, see if we can get Stitch into the vet. I'm going to make some lunch. I'm going to check on the cats. And then I'm going to come back. We got, uh, we're got. we going to carve this out. And then we are going to, I guess... We've got the paper already to screen print at least. We can start, start screen printing the white on this for the monokuma. That should be real straightforward and easy because it just lines up with the corner. And then maybe create templates for the other two stamps as well. And then I will need to cut black paper for... I guess we don't have those ones right now. I don't have to worry about it. We're just going to work with these three. That's it. Don't worry about it. We're not going to cut the black paper yet. Um, yeah. We'll screen print some carve. Screen print some white. And if we get around to it, create the uh, templates for the other two to start block printing. Or sorry, block print some white. And then, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Block printing and screen printing all in one. Let's go. I, my friends, will be right back. 
If you have yet to drop your unit off in the battlefield, you can do so by using the link that I just tossed in chat. You can also find our battle link in our channel panels below the video, where tomorrow we'll be doing more, more Warframe in the morrow. But for the it's art. So I'll be back with more printmaking. BRB. And then I gotta figure out too, do I take the earpiece with me so I can hear you guys? I don't wanna take the microphone with me. I don't wanna, I don't wanna. Let's.
And, ooh, yep, yeah, okay, I'm back. We should be back. We should be good. Oh, he's just napping. There's no new puke. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yep. So that's... We're observing, and we're taking notes, and we're calling. So there are no places with... I have now called everybody that google recommends in this city there are not <laughs> so i texted you synemius to see uh i gave you two cities uh to just double check that those are you know the next ones that i should start hitting up and uh, i have three places that after stream i will call to one of them uh if if the city i gave you synemius is not too far is for a cat clinic so hopefully did you just see what I just did? That was a fork that I folded in half. It was, it came folded. I don't want to unfold it because I don't want to break it. But like I, it was folded and I unfolded it and now it's a fork. Weird. It was inside a cup of noodles. We're trying uh, artificial chicken flavor. I like it. They're not even trying to hide it. But I also got a new, like a metal fork too, because I was like, I don't know, it was boiling water that we put in there. And so let's get a metal fork too. But uh, again, I just wanted, uh, cause I, my phone beep beep me and I need to make sure that I, catch everything correctly. Sorry, I was uh, just, I was just, just, just double checking notification. I don't wanna miss it. Thanks for those follows. So let's, uh, let's take a look. Oh, okay. We're trying, trying some, a new cup of noodles. New, new, new noodles. If you're here uh, at the Discord shenanigans, you'll, we, we talked about a cup of noodles. Are there any vegetables in this? There are no vegetables in this whatsoever. This needs Costco Bloom Shakalaka. There are no veggies in this at all. It is just noodles. Interesting. <laughs> no vegetables. Uh. I mean, tastes like ramen. I don't know. I'm a tiny gal, and I don't know about eating with this <clears throat> little tiny fork. Look at my hands make this fork look like it could be normal size. That's just how small it is. Here's a normal fork. Normal fork looks big in, in, in Dis's hands. Tiny fork looks normal. But yeah, we'll eat some some noodles and broth. There is no vegetables in this. I thought when they shook it, I heard some. It must have just been the pieces of noodles. It's very warm. Yum. I mean, it tastes good. It tastes like a cup of noodles would. Just without the vegetables. Gamers wouldn't want vegetables either, would they? Nah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I almost made the comment, 
It's hot though. At least it, it's got that going for it. I was like, oh, hold on, that was my doing. I I I did the hot, and that was that that was that was on me. So I'm putting the microphone over here so that I don't splatter you guys with my with my lunch. Just double checking that it's still coming through. Mm -hmm. I mean, tastes like a cup of noodles. Did I push the wrong button? What a, is it in the middle of songs? What's going on here? Okay, so when it gets to the end of songs and I can't hear anything, that's when I think that like I push the button and the music cut out, and then I end up pushing the button and the music cuts out. Yeah, it definitely it definitely makes headphone these uh, wire wireless headphones do make that silence in between songs seem even more cricket cricket maybe with 1999 we'll make another warframe bookmark especially if we can get a nice roundabout way to get these into the store I even cleaned up. There's not a, a not. I guess you can see it with the chat there. There used to be just a pile in front of the books. Now you can see all the books. I say there's a painting hanging on the wall. Fan art. Actually, really dope ass fan art to the point that like, I'm a fan of the artist who made my fan art. No, I'm I'm their fan. I'm almost done with my noodles. We do have the live chat and the Discord open. If anybody wants to join, let me know. We can invite. We'll be using this channel tomorrow as well. I wonder if I can use these headphones. Because then Stitch could sit in my lap without any issues. Because you just slept next to me all last night. Um, you could sit on my lap with no issues and we wouldn't have to worry about being really close to where the IEMs plug in. Because they're cordless. I can see why people really like the, uh, the wireless headphones. These are what the Sony WF-C700Ns, the noise canceling. I mean, I, I don't think I'd use these to be like, oh, yeah, let's let's listen to some 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 music. I'd still want my SIM gods for that one, my IEMs, my in ear monitors. But these ones, to another, you can take like a phone call, and there's supposedly a microphone in them. Not bad for under 100. Oh, that's hot. All right, we can sip on the soup here like it is a a beverage of sorts while we start being productive <sighs> thumbs up i appreciate you guys very much so um yeah Hold on let me uh just peace of mind double check okay no update and back to art. If you guys were wondering what this little guy is right here, it's Synemius, but they're talking. I wonder if I should have this as like an option where, what, like T3 subscribers, I'll make you, uh, or T2 or whatever, make you a little Discord dude. Make you a wonderfully inspired tune. What? So Synemius is here is the South Park Canadian gentleman talking guys. I should make the mouth a little bit more detached from the, the lower jaw with the horde undead 
motif, but they did also want to keep their facial mole for it. Just have a bunch of friends that look like that popped up across the bottom. That's funny. That's funny. I dig that. I guess to those of you that would want to chat, live chat during squad runs, like Dr. Evil, I met you in real life. Would yours just be bold? Would you put a little toque on there? A little, a little hat? A little hat? All right. We've got a Stream Raiders battle. I'm trying to think. Raptor, we squat up a lot too. Hypho, we squat up a lot too and play video games. All right. Let's get to where is Stream Raiders? Sorry, it's tiny. <laughs> we were like, I was sitting there, I was like, it's tiny. I'm like squinting, seeing that it's going to help me see the little tiny ass effing monitor. Oh, goodness. Let me just sip on my coffee. Ooh, we're really, or sip on my coffee, sip on my soup. All right. Next battle has started. Here we go, Raiders. And then we're going to start arting. It only took us two and a half hours. Technically, we're already further than we th I thought I was going to be for today because I didn't even know it was drawn out onto the screens. I thought they were just all laying on top for me to start. Raptor, zero kills, seven assists, 15 gold. Lafarage. I met you in real life with your little, uh, your little Discord tune, flannel. Some, some flannel and facial hair. All right, next. Uh... <clears throat> but this is where everybody would be the same height. <laughs> All right, next battle. And then instead of having my face take up screen time during our Discord dev, uh, dev streams, it's just a whole bunch of us uh, little South Park inspired eggheads chatting with each other. I was going for a 90s skateboard. Look, I, I, I thought you were, I thought that was just normal drip. What do you mean? As a Michigander, you look like you're just wearing normal day attire. <laughs> mm -mm. You're good. You're good. I was just I was just trying to set things up so that I can be a little bit more interactive. You know, who knows with the new content coming up? Might be some challenging squad stuff to do. It'd be nice to be able to yell at each other. I put this on the floor so I can't tip it over because it's already on the floor. So, like, it's already there. Uh, <laughs> I don't have uh, to reach very far back into my world. Well, the 90s. I got rid of most. If I would have known that stirrup leggings would have came back into style, it's not like your girl has grown since when stirrup leggings were fashionable. I would have kept them. <sighs> hindsight she 2020 no i'm just so like yeah yeah there's no there's no pressure at all i'm just i figured if i started reactive on synemius's computer got it up and going and then uh because i started this also on mine too i made this doodle while i was laying in bed with stitch uh from my phone and then what i simply did was i took this this song is a banger. What the fuck are we listening to? We are listening to Lepros Atonement. We're listening to Vola Radio. What's your problem? Oh, you, you actually liked it. You weren't being sarcastic. You weren't being facetious with that one. Forgive me. I thought you were being facetious. We were listening to Lepros Atonement. I thought you were, I, I was enjoying it. I thought you were making fun of me. I thought, you'll have to forgive me. I, I, well, then I sat there and like, I listened to it and I was like, I'm really liking it. And it's not often that I like things that aren't death metal. And, and I was like, maybe they're not joking. Sorry. 
I I immediately went into you were you were busting my chops. <laughs> forgive me. Forgive me, forgive me. Atonement. We put Vola in the other day, yesterday, and I uh, I was like, we can listen to Vola radio. So, yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I uh, I thought, oh, and I did get your message now, too. Okay, or, or that city. Copy. Okay, no, that, that's perfect. That's perfect. It gives me a... Uh... Gives me a... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope, that, that works. I need... I'm missing some sets of notifications, I think. My phone is giving me notifications that I'm not getting. Maybe because I don't have this open. Okay. We get now. Hmm? I was missing some things. <clears throat> The Olympic sprinter is this size. I was sure she was like 5'9". Nope. What? Wow. I thought she was much taller, too. Did you guys see the Canadian uh, Olympian who, what, bronzed and twerked? I was like, you get it, girl. You get it. Sometimes you just got to dance it out. Sometimes you just got to dance it out. So cool. So cool. Song was awesome. New Vola out too. <clears throat> Speaking of new out, Alien, Romulus, Friday. You missed the Olympic, you missed the Canadian Olympic twerking. Bronze medal twerked. <clears throat> and if anything, it goes to show you that people with a lot of muscle can be just as awkward. <laughs> These Olympics are fantastic. Lots of cheering for other countries. Yes. Yes. Like, as, as comical as they are, like, Australia in your breakdancing, as comical as they are, like, <laughs> Did you guys see the break? You guys saw the girl break. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> and then like every interview after that, I can't, I can't tell left for rage if those interviews are puns. Are they parodies? Is it meant to be funny? Or like, are these people serious? Because like, it was just, but then props to, I think the, it was the gentleman from Japan who, who won, who put on like that, gravity screw you type of type of routine like holy flailing one's body with so much control could i i can't I can't even they must not eat any carbs at all to have like an abdomen and torso that like can throw your body and your legs over but like everything else is standing still and you're upside down on your head just, just wild. She broke dance. She, she, she. <laughs> but like, from the comedy end of it, you know, there was that that poor girl break dancing, and then to like the extreme athleticism and like control of one's motor, like just your your. Sometimes it's a challenge for me to walk up and down the stairs. And those people were walking in the air. So, like, it is just, it's just wild. It's just, it's just. And the, the, the female rugby team. Oh. Those ladies are what, are what DE used to, to skull Pildren after. They have to be. I, I started following one of them on Instagram if you haven't seen her reel, hold on. Let me see if I can find the... She's got to be at the top of my stories because I've watched so many of her reels. Um, gosh, where are you, girl? Where are you, girlfriend? You are hilarious. 
Nope, uh, research Simone Biles last. Okay, uh, hold on. Olympic rugby. I don't care about the men's. I just want the women's. But it's only going to show me what's her. Yeah, did there? There she goes. She just. Uh, hello. Okay. There she is. This girl. She. I find her hilarious. Not only is like, oh my goodness. And they're so, like, they're so much younger, too. Everybody's very young. Um, is it Ilona Meyer? I think she is phenomenal. I, I follow her on Instagram because she did a, where we're going to go to your reels. Where was she? Where was she? We're in a creep. I think it was, oh, goodness. Now, now I feel like a, a creeper. She was hanging out. Maybe it was here. Nope. She was in Paris at the Louvre. I'm not going to be able to find her, her post about it, but she was sitting there on a bench and like her pretty, in a, like a very pretty evening out. And she was just rolling a necklace from side to side. And like they panned over the Louvre, the art museum. And they go to her and she was, hmm, makes you want to watch the Da Vinci Code. And right then and there, I was like, girl, you got my follow. That is <laughs> <laughs> it was just uh, Simone Biles is, she is she's she's a superhero she she's a four foot day wonder woman Simone Biles like artisan sculpted calf muscles she's she's uh, Simone Simone Biles is 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 the like super she is a super hero like step aside superman who <laughs> uh okay let's get to to carve in some of this now but yeah the olympics who would have thought who would have thought a star with snoop dogg and a little martha stewart hanging out with the equestrian crip walking horses now, uh, I'm engrossed in the highlights. You think I watched the whole entire thing? That's so long. So long. Some of the commentators are so boring. I like to watch uh, the F1 commentators uh, on Sundays. I think they're hilarious. I don't like to watch the real races. I just like watch the dots go around. It looks like the, the game snakes, so the dots are trying to eat the tail. Huh? Could you? How could it get any better? And then Simone Miles, Simone Biles straight taken to Instagram telling everybody who was complaining about her winning another medal. And she basically said, not my fault, fools, get good. <laughs> She's like, it's not my fault you guys suck. <laughs> but you just were like, ooh, she got you there. <laughs> Jay Barkey, did you all see the post someone made of Snoop Dogg watching skateboarding event with un Undefined Man? Uh, anyone who believed Clark Cat would be unidentified immediately as Superman has to be the <laughs> unidentified man. I didn't. I did not see that. I did not see that. <laughs> oh, Snoop. Oh man, Tony Hawk real life Clark Kent without a skateboard and a helmet. Oh really? Oh really? That's funny. That's funny. Uh, oh gosh. However, Olympics, you do not have to cut into my anime and make it so that nothing new comes out during the weeks of the Olympics. That's like that's like me saying, all right, it's Renaissance season, everyone. We're going to stop Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> Sorry, you guys can't get your soaps because uh, we got the Renaissance Festival going on this month. <laughs> 
lot of you guys go, no, it is. Not, a, not at all. Not at all. A worldwide spectacle of Olympic athleticism. And you're... <laughs> Huzzah. <laughs> um, yeah, Tony Hawk flies under the radar if he isn't actively carrying skateboard paraphernalia. Because he's getting old and people forget that. Everybody gets older. People are forgetting we, we're getting old. I mean, sure, he still has the facial structure of the Tony Hawk that we all know, but, like, homie's getting old. His kids are getting older. I just saw there was a golf anime years ago. I proposed that as a joke, the most ridiculous. Yeah. Uh, there was a women, there was a girls' golf anime out before the most recent one that you've seen of the uh, the boys playing golf. So take that. They tried it out with the women. I guess it went so great. They're like, you know what? Let's try it with oh. all. <clears throat> Just to make sure that I can get into these areas without any issue, I will use an X-Acto blade. We're just cutting out the mask of Huntress. That way we can do some block printing before we screen print. I'm just gonna go like this. Yeah, be like I just cheated that one. I'm gonna take it. <sighs> okay, nope, that was outside. Sorry, I thought I heard something. Because he's sleeping in the room, just off to the, like, I could hear him when he moves with my basement grate. Was that the anime with giant uh, mechanic guys golf courses that were, no, I didn't watch it. I wouldn't know, Jay Barky. Hold on. Hold up. Uh, stored underground, like, the soccer pitches in Europe? I don't. What? <laughs> I uh I have not watched the soccer what's it called Blue Block I haven't watched that either though I guess it's popular I I uh, I haven't blue blocked I've been blue blocked I did watch the girls play baseball or softball or whatever their their baseball I don't think there's going to be a season two of that even I've come to terms. Hello, Karak. Welcome on in, Adam. I hope you're having a good day. Yeah. Okay, so I think we have
the head of the bunny. Good to go. I'm gonna sheath all of, ow, the sharp objects, hopefully correct, before I joust myself. She's really stuck in there, don't you know? Sometimes you have to use another tool to shake another tool loose. So I'll put these back in here. I should not need to, oh, she says that, but like, as I see, I, I look at the dog on Rampa one and I see that I could clean that up. I should clean that up. Ugh. I'm gonna clean it up. <clears throat> Gosh darn. Yeah, I'll just clean it up a little bit. That way we know it won't pick up any ink. Cool. That should that should be good. And I think is this going to give us a secondary line? Not there, at least. Okay. I think we're good. Give me back the little, uh, there we go. Oh, speedball. Okay, now I'm gonna put the tools away so I don't get them all sticky. Um, and I say that because I'm going to look for the white. We want block parenting, I, uh, what is this? Screen printing ink, I'm gonna do block printing first. Are we? Gonna be doing any white? I got white block printing ink. Are these all gonna be white except for the silver? Do I have silver block? Or do I? I do I have silver? Question mark. Something tells me I actually might. Awkwardly enough, nope. That's black screen printing. That's pink screen printing. That's black block printing. Give me a second. We've got green, yellow. These are all screen printing inks. Interesting. Silver block printing ink. We might be able to just get away with thickening up uh, some silver acrylic paint. We'll have to test that out. Let me see how small of a container of a silver printing ink we can find on the interwebs. Let's go, it's adventure time. We're gonna go over here. We do have, how many more minutes left on Stream Raiders? Eight minutes left on our Stream Raiders battle. Oh, let me move. I'm seeing now that our Discord icons are over top of music so we'll just put him over here and if I push the button yeah he just talks I think that's fun um, okay and oh, oh I got rid of that I wanted to leave that up so that you guys could see the music we don't need the promo reel all the time. Let's get rid of that. Or I moved it around. Of course. I took it out of and it should have a longer title. There we go. Inadvertently trying to clean things up and I There we go. Cool. Q, 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 Q. So we do have the block printing there. Let's go here. Um, 
check Amazon first, don't we? What does it say? International oh, twine. Oh, my Korean barbecue tongs on Amazon went up in price. <laughs> it's just like, what is this showing? All right, we want silver block printing ink. Simple as that. And we will see. Oh, I can get, because if I can get like a little tube, that's perfect. If I had to purchase a big tube, that is just, that would be a waste if I had to get eight ounces. But 2.5 ounces of silver. Water soluble block printing ink. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And we'll also then test this silver to see if it behoove us to do gold block printing on the underside uh, of, oh, I'd want to do that. Screen print it then for Magda's underskirt for the corners. Hmm. Anywho, 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 let's see, testings. Not for linoleum printmaking. This silver ink is way too thick for printmaking. Try and so ways to thin it out, but it's way too thick. Water soluble, yep, never dries in damp environment. And even after it dries, it'll run and wash off with water. Uh, not what I need, but should fit the bill otherwise. Smooth, not running, not dry. Okay, so some people got this thing that they are going to be able to do t shirt art with it by the sounds of those reviews. No, we want, it's supposed to be tacky. You're supposed to use a roller. It's supposed to be like tacky, 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 tacky. So we will add this to the cart and we will pick up some silver. Oh, this is block printing on fabric. Why did I want to block print on fabric? Oh, no, 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 I wanted a silver. Oh, oh, these are the options. Oh, hold up, metallic silver. No, I would want gold. Currently unavailable. Of course it is. Of course it's currently unavailable. But it in no, but they do have Speedball does have a fabric block printing ink. I figured that they would. I just didn't know it was in that type of Well, the more you learn. Just learning and growing, Adam. Learning and growing. All right, she uh, she only got the ink out. I got nothing else, so let's let's keep going. Put that crumbs away. So to go along with the ink, I am going to need my roller, which is in the drawer above it. I am also going to need a platter to put it all on. I am going to want to get. A palette knife to assist. Where is the? Uh, there we go. I'll say my Liquitex palette knife. I am going to take the container here. It's got all of our. We're gonna do the white. I guess we can do both of these today. Let's start with just one first. Let's let's just start with one. Let's not get overzealous. But in a perfect world, we'd be able to get to two of them. Uh, <clears throat> put this over here. That is the case of goods. Well, there's where I put that keyboard. Stays there. Pin that down. I want this. We'll have this. I am going to take my phone. And see what we have here. We can go. Okay, yeah, I already read that. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. I will make those calls then. Every day is a school day. But only if you're willing to learn. You can't, yeah, at some, I mean, you can't force people to learn. No matter how much you try to cram it into their brain. You can't force people to want to learn, so. Open that up, put it behind me. We are going to start with, quiet please, with my, quiet please with myself today. Finally delivered and restored Bill Hawk. 
Darth Rent, thank you so much for those biddies. Uh, I've been working uh, on my spare time the past couple. Nice. Restored that bill hook. Very nice. Darth, thank you so much for those bits. All right, so let's get... We're cleaning up the area. That way it only has the necessities. And we're going to first start with our doggone Rampa. We do have all of... Our screen printing guys drawn out. We're just need to go over everything with drawing media or the masking medium. So we'd be using the drawing fluid and then I would be uh, filling in the screen filler with screen filler as well. So these will be the process that I use for the screen. Again, the blue is first, which is my drawing fluid. So everywhere that I want the ink to go through the screen is where I will put this liquid and then once this sits and dries i usually give it 12 hours just because i tend to go over things that are highly detailed like ours are um, then i will go over it with the screen filler filling in all of the other parts of the screen that i do not want the ink to seep through with our screen filler and then after this dries and i usually <sighs> You gotta let it dry all the way, but you don't want it to sit as long as you may let the drying fluid sit because this may be on top of the fluid, the drying fluid areas and you want the drying fluid to, you know, dissolve with the water, but also flake off the fluid on top. And, and then you might, it's, it's, it, you'll see the process. We're gonna do the whole entire process uh, here, but it is a process. We've done the process before and you can check it out in our VODs uh, with our, Denji and 2B. We've done the whole entire process here. Thank you, kindly. See you. Have a good, have a good day, Darth Rat. We'll be playing Warframe tomorrow. Is it Giles Slime? Hey, Dis. Happy Monday. Hello, hello to you. We're getting our block printing out. I guess I should change it to block printing because uh, we'll be screen printing after we block print. So, block printing day. And let's make our way back on over. I'm going to start this battle. I'm going to take you guys with me. We're going to go check on Stitch. It has been an hour. Oop, oop, oop. Hold on. I was going to give you guys at least a Stream Raiders battle to watch. All right. So let's go. Let's go check on Stitch together. It's been another hour. And I just checked, uh, I'm not wearing my Crocs this time, so if I step in vomit, I'll feel it. Hey, Pac, how's it going, buddy? Yeah. Your big brother's not feeling good. We're gonna go check on him, okay? Just don't fuck up the antiques, please. But you can stay up there. All right. So far, so good. How are you doing, buddy? Huh? How's it going? Oh. Did you go and get food? I didn't hear you get up to get food. No? Aw, do you like the head pads? Okay. As long as touching you doesn't cause pain, then maybe it is just something you ate something funny. Hopefully you're, you just have shitty ass food. You don't like the food anymore. Maybe, maybe the food upsets your tummy. We get you something new. I'll call more vets later. Hey, buddy, we'll get you in somewhere. We'll get you in somewhere. Somebody look at your poop. Check your bloods. I'm glad that you're still drinking water. Chat wants me to give you all the head pats possible. They send their love. Okay. Oh, look at your little shitty little brother came to see you too. You're not, you're not as happy to see him? Hey, Puck. Hey, old turd. Yeah, yeah, I'll pick you up and give you some love. Your brother doesn't feel well. That's why he's getting the extra attention. Give you some cheek kisses. You're gonna be, you could be in a good, you good watching, watching over stitches, Puck? He's not been sleeping, running around, eating his wet food too. Yeah? All right, I'll see you guys in just a little bit.
Yeah, he's just laying around. I could have, should have, could have, should have taken that cup of noodles with me downstairs. Forgot about it until I came up here and smelled it. <laughs> uh, opening up our captain's chest. 200 gold to Jay Barky. Two kills, five assists. Jay, please enjoy. Couldn't find the alphabet. I'll give him another Chiru, too, if he's able to keep him down. I will, Stitches. You can keep him down. I definitely will, buddy. All right. I don't think there's anything... Oh, we gotta go and back and collect. Been distracted. Mm. Earn tokens. We can probably get down with that. Maybe I'm gonna go to the store. I'm just gonna grab all of them. I'll get that later. And we'll collect these. Let's drop into the boss battle. It is time. We'll do another climb on the field. Oh no, you know what we'll do? We're Stitch and Puck. Yeah, Stitch and Puck causing a ruckus. All right, Raiders, we are on to our next battle. Excellent join battle in chat for the link to our Street Raiders game. Well, that plays. I am going to do some block printing. What could go wrong? What could go wrong, she says. I have a feeling that I should get a clipboard. And uh, just like I did with our screen printing, where I usually uh, slide these into... The book corners. I wonder where my book, where my corners are. I feel like I should do the same thing with this. That way, if I print it and then I go to pull this up, the bookmarks will come up too. Okay, we gotta do a little bit of. Oh, look at it! It's already ready for me to uh, to use. Huzzah! Okay, there's that. Um, we need the little corner tabs. If I was corner tabs, where would I have stuffed them? Ha ha, that was easier than I thought. I was like, check the random drawer. They were in the random drawer. All right. Now, it doesn't really matter where on here we place these. Just that. And I should get the masking, the blue masking tape, hoping that it doesn't. Destroy my clipboard as much as cheap ass art masking tape would. Let's do this. Once again, we're trying to prevent it from lifting up with each print. So I'm gonna just take this and wrap it around. Ah! Wrap it around after it's stuck to the board all the way. Wrap it around after it's stuck to the board. After it's stuck to the board. There we go. Wow. All right, and we're going to do the same thing to the sides. I think, though... I should be able to cut this in half. I don't have any thinner tape. So we're just gonna use what we got. There's that. 
And then based off of where this goes, see, we, uh, we line it up with the bottom there. We're going to get one that doesn't have an X off because these ones are misshapen. That's why I've X'd them. We will. Yep. It should fit perfect in the corner there. So let's then. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So this corner would not have it. Yes, yes, yes to the other three. Yep. There's one. And these will just help make sure that our bookmark does not move. If it was bigger, I'd use just straight masking tape, but these are tiny. So. I'll just try to make sure that this song. Okay, we'll put one down then at a time, I guess. I thought I could do the top two. Top two in one go, but I was mistaken. And then I also think I got it flipped here, so let's make sure. If this goes down, this has got to go on this side over here. Cool. So then when I print, it lines up with this corner here. It does look like this will hit just a little bit. So let's do this then. It doesn't have to be perfect on this side. If I know that it's going to be all the way through on those, that'll be beautiful, beautiful. And then we'll just line it up. I'm going to make sure that we put a marker. What's this song? Is now what I'm. We come out of that song. Wildfire, periphery. I got you. I got you. We just uh, just didn't need a little diddle right there at the end. Papsio, welcome on in. Thank you so much for the seventy stream streak. Hope you're having a good day. I have an image to share in the mail room. Oh, you got your item. You just got a package. <laughs> you got a package. See, better late than never. Oh, <laughs> that one's right around the corner from where I live. My mother lives. That's that's perfect. Um, let's see. Going up to mail time. Mail time. Art studio. Oh, there's your next uh, horror movie prop. That's very cool. It's how it started, how it ended. Nice. 
You could do a lot of cleaving with that. It's not there yet. Well, I was looking. I was just looking. I was just looking. I was just perusing before I start making a mess. Uh, let's take this. It's supposed to be like that. So I'm gonna put it over here. And this is how we forget and uh, silverware well, gets left up here. But that's something to complain about for another day. We'll put this over here. I'm sure we're gonna need it again. Oh, but not if it's an empty box. We need that stuff inside of it. Here. Let's uh, put the corners back in. And we are gonna do some block printing today. Put that off to the side. We definitely won't kick it or cause a, a mess later on. No, never. And then I need to get you guys more table. If it's already running, you should pull it up. There we go. I'm right-handed, so with these first couple, we're going to figure out what side of the paper we want to print on. And uh, we'll either decide if we want to print on the smooth side or, oh, somebody's in the Discord, and it looks like it's a Dr. Evil. It works! It works. And then we were talking too. So if you, you know what? You sometimes you just got to accept the delay on the image, uh, on the, uh, streaming screen. If I push that, you can see Sinemius's image. He wanted to go with the horde undead. He talks like he's one of the Canadian guys from South Park. I was really proud of that. <laughs> It's the little things. All right. So let's. Yeah, so it'll use your Discord image unless you have set up something different, appropriately different. I should actually drop this into the live chat section here. Give me the chat box for the Discord. And we will put the link, and then we are going to, I can pin that later. Uh, and then I will also drop that link for the reactive. If anybody wants to change it from their Discord image, there is the reactive image. And it can be the muted, delayed, where it's shaded out. And then uh, it could be something different when you go to talk. Uh, thanks, it's nice. Uh... Little blade, yeah. Previously handed, it was more worn than wood. It looked very rusty, very rusty, zero rusty. Hello, the Nick come to. I hope you're having a good day. All right. So I'm expecting to these first couple to pick up all of the fuzzies. Also, you can see too. There's a bunch of pencil marks because we're using white. That'll all be visible in the first couple of prints that we do. So uh, trial and error. So we've got four poorly cut ones and then we can dabble in with the extra guys there water soluble i do have the fan going we should be fine it just goes boop, boop, and you don't you don't hear the the chatting in the background all right hold on let me see then mm -hmm. <laughs> I can hear myself quite clearly. I would say I can I can hear you, and I'm guessing that if I can hear you guys, then Discord can hear you guys, or at least that's what I. It should just be a push to talk. So we'll put some ink down, not too much. She says, as there's a big glob on the table. Let's see here. So we're gonna ink it. And then uh, I guess we're going to test, we should test the, the bumpier side, the textured side first. 
because that is the more question. We know how to. Yeah, I'm not sure where the echo came from. Oh, so the echo is coming through because I gave a different. One second. Uh, we're going to do properties for this. Properties for this here. I need to go over here and then if I. Oh, where is it? Audio. There. Now, now try. Maybe. I fixed it. Maybe. Maybe. He totally, well, I, I clicked a button and I was like, well, now definitely come through. <laughs> uh, uh, then I, then I, I fixed that one. I, I fixed that one. It's my workaround for not having a. Uh, my it won't go through today because I did not give Sinemius that privilege and I'm not on my big battle station. I didn't have it. It's not even powered on. So during break, I could go and like fix things around. So tomorrow you'll be able to just be in the discord if you want to. You won't be able to see them the stream, but you'll be able to hear what I'm saying, probably in more real time for in gameplay than the stream delay. Today's our today's our, our trial and error testing it out. Minion popped by at the beginning of our stream when we were first trying to put everything together. We'll get there. We'll get there. Baby steps. So I'm just making sure that I ink the whole entire guy. Then we will set this up there. And first one. Will I be able to line it up with the edge? And that could have been worse. That could have been worse. And then we just make sure that we uh, stick it all down. Now, I do know that the corner to be easier to pull up would be this side. All right, so with texture, you can really see, you can really see the texture. But I don't know, maybe that's not a bad thing. Maybe that's not a bad thing, being able to see the texture like that. Is that like an artistic uh, choice? It does leave a texture on the stamp too. So that was just the first one. We'll get more ink on this and whoop, throw it around a bit. We'll give it a shot and try out on the smooth side next. Then we stamp it down. Oh, it slid. Every printmaker is worst nightmare. I felt it slide. And that was because I pushed down on a slant. But I think I do like it on the smooth side better. All right, let's, let's give it another shot. We do need the ink just to adhere to the different... Oh, well, let's hope that doesn't make too big of a mess. There's going to be black that goes on over top of it. So I have to remember that. Ooh, work the ink into our stamp. Now, part of me thinks that maybe I should also consider... Oh, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try to make a mess. What happens if I try to place it on top? If I've had a bigger stamp, I would do it this way, but I'd also then send it through a press, but it's so small. With this, it just kind of like wherever it falls. This is where you'd have a brayer. She's my finger, it's fine. 
Yeah, so without something to make sure that it's really pressed down, it doesn't uh, fully ink the whole surface. So let's go to flipping it back over using the weight and just not moving her. Make sure I get that edge, the outside edge and corner. <laughs> gentle push, gentle press, and then we pull her up. Yeah, I wonder what's going to be the way to make sure We get an even press through it all. Because like here it's great. And you can see where it didn't move this time at least. What will be going over top of it? And go figure. So the side that turned out real nice too is just going to be the side that gets cut out in all black. Because like, I don't necessarily hate it. You know, there's going to be another layer that goes on top. We just wanted to do it partially white. Let's try a couple more. Maybe I'll get better at this. I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful. We just wanted it to be a different color too. Maybe I'm thinking, you know, I'm not, I'm not thinking correctly with it having to be solid. And we're just going to use this to scrape all the goods back to the top. Making sure the ink is on my roller. And then I'm going to take it back to here. And I don't want it in the areas that there's not supposed to be ink. But I am trying to make sure that we get it. All right. Here we go. That one turned out better. That one turned out a lot better. I guess I didn't put it off to the side. That one turned out a lot better. Yeah. All right. Let's just keep smooshing them. Where is... So that whole part... Okay. <laughs> Gonna keep smooshing. We'll just fill up the table. So this was a bad one. This was a tester guy too. Tester guy too. So that was the first non-testing paper that we did in the correct orientation. So. Let's keep going. Again, I'm lining it up with the edge and the corner. Uh, 
I'm maybe. We'll learn from our mistakes, right? I didn't know if like using a different, like how you would if it goes through, you know, the smooshing plates. Yeah! Fuck this song. Fuck this song. I, I can't, I can't down vote that one fast enough. Why? What did I do wrong? <laughs> what did I do wrong? Where did that come from? Just because the kid has tattoos on his face doesn't mean... <sighs> did I hurt you? Music? YouTube music? Like, what was that? Trying to broaden my musical outlook. That's not the way to do it. The squeaky squeaky is the ASMR that comes along with block printing. Just gonna WD 40 my wheel. All right, on to the next one. And then we'll drop this again on it. Kind of add that uh, direct downward. Yeah. Cool. And again, if this side turns out with less white on it, that's the side that's going to be all black anyways. So good to know. I was I was trying to be afraid of pushing on the outside edges because I didn't want uh, it to slip and slide. So I can I can give it a little bit more oomph on the sides. I meant to get it on the table. It's supposed to go there. Try to make sure my hands are clean. We try. Making sure I get that edge this time. We're just seeing what the process would be. Oh wow, that turned out really solid. Yeah. Sometimes I find it easier just to wipe it onto the, the roller. I know, I know. A lot of you just went, oh, you're not supposed to do that. Shush. Give me one second. My nose is running. Nose is running off to the side. So I'm just 
Making sure I've covered all of the edges without there being too much. I don't want to glob it on there, but I do want there to be ample. And then again, just like I liked how that one turned out, so I'm going to carefully press the edge here. And add it to the next. All right, and we will drop down that Stream Raiders battle. Go team! So I think I like a combination of both using the board and making sure the edges are good. Oh, I didn't set up my paper. All right, opening up that captain's chest. We're going to give 50 gold to Hwani, Hwani underscore 85. Where are you? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. There you are. Confirm. Next. Yep. Yeah, give us the next map. Oh, it's a super loyalty boss chest. We'll start this one. Whatever we don't finish, we can finish during tomorrow's stream. And do we have any, uh, nope, just win event tokens. Copy. We'll put a Clem on the field then. Clem, do battle, please, and thank you. Raiders, if you'd like to join me, we'd love to have you. Exclamation point battle in chat with the link to our stream Raiders game. You can also find that link in our channel panels below the video player. So we're going to put this down. And peel. Ooh, that one probably got a little feathered like that because we waited to, to, to ink it for a minute there. It just kind of sat, kind of sat and dried out a little bit. Shh, don't tell the, don't tell the stamp that. I've just been using my apron to clean any residue. It's fancy. It's fancy that way. Shh. Don't tell my apron. Oh, I got it all over my hand. All over my thumb. <laughs> it just kind of squirted out the side. So it's like, I wonder if I could scoop it up. What does it wonder? That's a nice one.
All right. The trick is once you place it down, not to move or jiggle it. I wonder if I was on this screen and I took, ooh. Would you guys be able to see more? Probably. Probably. So we'll leave it here. <laughs> but I also see them what happens. We're responsible. My little friendship window. Doctor was like, yeah, no, I'm good. I'm out of here. <laughs> Just move my little my little friends around. All of my VTuber friends that I talk to are gonna love this. Because we don't really talk to that many of you friends. We don't talk to that many at all. It should be, it'll just be real about that one. I can't remember if I was too busy messing with... Nice! That one turned out good! Turned out real nice. Maybe too nice. It's because Tesseract was playing. Altered state. Vola Radio. Trying to scrape it before it gets too coagulated, if you will. Ah! It is water soluble, but we don't. Let's work and work and work. Try not to get that on the mouse pad or keyboard and all that off to the side there. Trying, trying. Wake me up. Then we'll do this. Lurk on the phone. Thanks so much for that lurk. Much appreciated. There we go. Huzzah. And we'll wipe down the bottom there. Brayer would probably have been nice for the one that we did upside down. They are kind of turning pink. I'm not sure how I feel about that. 
Yeah, it, it's turning pink on the paper. Like you can tell now if it's next to white, it looks pink. Interesting. I definitely don't like that. I don't like that at all. Hmm. I guess the other alternative would be like what? To layer them, paper layer, get like a cricket, cut them out. Mm. Hmm. Because they're printing nice. Like, I'm really happy with how they're printing. But not how they're drying. I don't want a pink bear. I want a white and black bear. Because what's starting out is this. Oh, now that I set it down, I'm not going to pick it back up. What started as this, see how it's very white, it's turning out like this. You can see the difference in color, even if it doesn't look pink, pink, pink. It look, it's drawing different. Um, it's wild that the pigment in the paper would be dying in the ink like that. Chemicals. Interesting. Well, how would we combat this then? We don't want to waste our time. We don't need to ink anymore because this isn't. This isn't. Uh, this isn't working how we thought it was going to work. So I guess the only other option then would be. To cut them out with paper, out of paper. Oh, we do see Mama just this Saturday. She, I say that because she's got a cricket machine. So that would give me what? Enough time to turn. Oh, because then that means the same thing would happen. It might not be an issue with. Our Halloween dude. Because the mask would be the white face mask on the sea blue paper. But it would then give us a light baby blue mask on the Huntress, which does not strike fear into the hearts of anyone. So if you're just now tuning in with us, we are, or have been block printing, we're working on some dog on rampa stomps. Uh, however, the white area that we've been uh, block printing out before we screen print on to, it prints real nice. She prints real nice. There it is with the white. But as it's drying, it's drying pink. Um, that's, that's, that's not ideal. <laughs> So, uh, on that note, then, we're going to leave. I've got to wash the block stamps and wash that stuff. So, there's that issue. So, my next thing, then, would be, if we can't block print because it's going to pick up and change it, we're going to have to uh, create 
cutouts. So I guess, Thomas, you're, you're right. This is where it would be in your, your wheelhouse. Instead of doing a laser printer, though, I'm just going to use like a Cricut. And I will need... The mask. Hey, we had a friend join us. I will need the mask for... Oh, they're just like that. As soon as they come, they leave. Friends come, friends go. All right, uh, we have... So, we're going to need the white area, white for Monokuma. We'll also need, I guess if that's the case, then we could do white for Monokuma, then I could do a light gray. For the Huntress mask. Then we would need a white mask for our Scream Dune. And silver for a Scream Knife. Oh. Mm. So I'm just trying to think. I'm just trying to think, maybe then. No, I can, I can still do it. I can still do it. Because then I'm thinking like, well, my death note idea have the same issues. I think we should start, though, with the bear. I think we should start with the bear. And I'm obviously going to want to put together more bears than I will. Because they're all going to print differently. Well, it doesn't, it doesn't matter if it's going to align. The ink's turning pink. No amount of press is going to fix that reaction. <laughs> So like, this is going great. Our prints are, are fine. I'm very happy with how they're printing. But when I put the last one down and I looked over, yeah, 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 the bear, the bear is turning pink. <laughs> and that's, that's my dilemma right now, is uh, the black and white bear on red is turning pink. So I'm like, okay, I won't have that an issue. Obviously we've done the black ink. Uh, on top of everything, need to seal the paper with something first, but then, then we're put Mod Podge the paper before I then print on it. That's just then I have to deal with the paper curling before I do my first print on it. Yeah, it would probably just behoove us to when we see Mama Dis on Saturday fixative. I mean, you could use that, but like, then at what point would it just be easier to? cut the bears out of paper, spray glue them all down, or even just like the glue dots, spray them down, you know, to, to put them down and then screen print over top of it all. And then once I laminate them, it's sealed no matter what. So I don't need to like glue the whole entire bear down, just enough that it won't move while I screen print over top of everything. But knowing that the white block printing ink changes colors with the paper, so on red it changes pink that means if i do the mask for huntress on the navy blue it's going to turn baby blue a light blue 
Huntress would not be cool with that. Um, I don't think we would have an issue with the white on the sea foam green, but if I'm already pushing print, you know. And I think I already have. Let's check the paper back here. Metallic paper like this for the knife would be very weird. Print the red on the, the white. Oh, that would be a way to, to work around it. I didn't think of it that way. Yeah. Yep, that would that would have been a way to work around it. Twould have been a way. Twould have been a way, but we're past that now. Uh, I would have to then cut out another block for the whole entire background. I do have the red block print, but then I'd be wasting all of the red pieces of paper that I've already cut out here. So do we just cut out white paper to glue on top? And like have the cricket do all the work, or do we cut another block and, and print away? I'm gonna say we do the paper route. That would, in, in hindsight, I had no clue that the white ink was gonna do this. I don't want, I thought about double shy the white. That's where I was wet. I was like, yeah, I don't wanna do that. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't wanna screen print twice. I would not want to screen print that twice. Um, we've got a, a foil card stock that we could do the knives out of. Oh, I think I've got metallic here in one of these. Grays. Oh, I might have the bone material in here. Cardstock. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Is there a light, light, light gray? Would you use the smooth side? Yeah, I think. Alignment does sound like hell. Yep, yep, yep. I'm just like checking papers. If you have a spray fixative, you could, but then I'd have to deal with the base paper curling with the fixative because your, your base fixative would be like a even, you know, like a hairspray even can act as a fixative to a certain degree. So if we use this then for the masks, For the masks of the Huntress. Look at Mama Dis, I'm putting uh, the card stack that you gave me to use. I think that's too dark. That's too blue. I wonder what she used this for. She ripped out some of them. And then I think this is where I pulled. Yeah, I don't think so. Nope, these don't have white in them. Here's some blue. Here's some more variants of red. Oh. We're going to use this paper instead of this paper. It'll finish up that collection there. Aha, I do have some whites. Not enough to get all of the Mononoka. Mono, monokuma's done. How many are these? Like three? Got three of them. Three of the cardstocks in white. Hold on. It doesn't need to be the actual paper because I've just got white cardstock. That should work too. You'd think, right? Right? Right, I think, I think, I think that that might work. So let's tuck this. Is there... Yeah, we'll just 
Put you back. Don't fall. You're so gonna fall. Put these back in there. Just trying to see if we had a silver or a bright colors. Bright, those are indeed bright colors. Yellow. That's more of a gray, 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 too gray, right? Uh, not horrible. Not horrible. Where are the navy blue? I think that will be fine. Just, just, uh, just checking colors. Checking colors. Oh no, you all not gonna fit back down here, are you? <laughs> all right, and so then you will go up here. This is my silver paper. I do have silver paper in this drawer. Literally staring at me in the face that I'll have to cut because I think it's 18. Here's some silver paper. It's the same paper that we used for our 2B bookmarks. I have a bunch of this. Yeah, I think this will be fine. So we'll cut these in half so that they're easier to fit. On the page, but yeah, that'll uh, white, white paper. I could have sworn I had white cardstock here. Yeah, and I will just. Just making sure it's all the same kind of paper. Because I'm just going to then grab the folder. Let's see what other kind of papers we have down here. That's the photo paper. Not cardstock. That is Bristol board. Legit stack of Bristol board. Oh, that's tracing paper. Okay, I think this is what we have to work with here. You are specialty paper. We'll just put you in there for now. Then we will use this as well as the masks and this. So I need to then take these and digitize them. So I will scan them into the computer downstairs and go from there. Bummer. I was really hoping we were going to make some uh, a good dent in this, or at least get the first round done so that we could screen print. But it looks like I've got a little bit more setting up and light work before we can really dive into this. Hmm. I jumped into it. Like, uh, we are going to smash and grab. But it's a good thing then that I held off on the drawing fluid it's going to be a week, and we don't, I don't want that hiccups to sit for that long. Uh, so yeah, first order of business. Getting them cut so that they can go on to the bookmarks and they aren't going to change colors. Bummer on the white. That is really exciting about trying to layer the block and the screen printing, but if it's going to just turn pink and I'm looking at the white stuff, right? Yeah, they just keep getting pinker. It just keeps getting pinker. So like... Now you can see that it's just getting pinker. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Very, very interesting. We will set the screen printing stuff up behind me. So it's out of the way. And I don't want to accidentally kick it either. but I got a whole entire week before I can go back to it. So over there you shall stay. Bummer, bummer. 
Bummer. Boomer. Well, let me put this stuff away then. We got a little, we're a little ways off before I'm going to need that. And I should put, actually, you know what? We'll just put the bookmarks up here for now. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to hit you, Owie. We'll put the bookmarks up here safely. Safe and out of the way. I'm going to put my cleaner. This is cleaning the screen in case when we are putting the dry meth drawing fluid on there. We needed to clean it, but we didn't get to that part today. Why do art projects just take so long to get done? <laughs> I'll leave the fluid right there. I'll put this away over here for now. Safely tucked away. I'll put this, that's what I was using to press the stamps down with, back where it's supposed to go. I will have to wash, I can just, I'm just going to set this upside down. I'm going to have to wash it, clean that up, we'll put the ink away so that we don't make a mess. But speaking of messes, I do believe I have some on the table. So I'm going to clean up the mess that I accidentally made. Whoops. Whoops. We were, we were trying to be productive and really just, just made a mess. I'm going to need to clean the stamp as well. Almost forgot about that. These stamps, though, are uh, obsolete. You know what we're going to have to do? We'll, uh... Over there for now. Okay, that was our Stream Raiders battle. So let's head on over to Stream Raiders. Oh, Stream Raiders looks like my uh, bare work spot, worktop. Just kidding. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, we still won this. We so won this. Karak, one kill, ten assists. Gold goes to you. Gold goes to you. And we'll play more stream winners tomorrow stream. Tomorrow stream. Yeah. Because we'll finish up this loyalty super boss chest tomorrow too. Hmm. Cool. Thanks, Gigi. No, thank you, Gigi. Gigi, thanks, thanks, thanks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Well, we've come to a crashing halt, both with what I thought I could do and what I could do. <laughs> uh, pink. Why are they turning pink? Like watching and just, it's just. Uh... Yeah, definitely would have had to have sealed the pores to the paper. And you know, maybe that had something to do too with the using the scrapbooking paper, Thomas. I've just been using a bunch of leftover scrapbooking paper. You know, that's Mama Dis has been like, I don't need this. Like if I would have worn or you used the white and the red. Yeah, so it's it's turning pink. They're turning pink. 
even this is pink. So like, here's the white, here's the pink. Oh, oh. Like it looks like the pink that I used for the stamp. I couldn't have anticipated the bleeding. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's, it's, uh, one, of those, one of those things that look like the pink of my nails. Um, so, Mama Dish, she does that card making stuff. One thing I have not added to the arsenal is a Cricut and or brother whatever, because Mama Dish has got it. Gives me a wonderful excuse to go and hang out with her. We're going to be seeing her this Saturday for her birthday, but... Hey, Mama Dis, I've got some files and paper with me. I'm going to follow you home and borrow that cricket of yours. Uh, she's got, like, the, the fancy all-in-one pooper scooper one. I don't know what it does. Uh, the, the print, the ink is definitely drawing. It's, it's like, wet, saturating, and uh, it was an unforeseeable consequence. But this is, you know, now we know. But we also know, too, we're not going to waste our time just printing a bunch of them that we know that they're all going to turn pink, and that's not what we want. We also are not going to then waste our time with block printing out the masks of the Huntress this way, too, if we know that it's going to pick up the paper from the same company. I did get the, it's, yep, uh, Mama did. So she's she just, I said sure. So now we know. What I'm going to have to do, though, is uh, use her Cricut. I will this week put this into a like pdf an image file uh like a vector file and take it over to her place saturday and then we will paper cut out and i will line it up and then i'll just use like some of the scrapbook little dots to stick it we won't have to really worry about gluing all of the edges and sides of the bear down before i screen print over top of it because i will be laminating all of them so I just need to get the bear so it won't wiggle and jiggle in place. And I think I've got like some old scrapbooking squares or something like that that like use this instead of glue. It'll be so much easier and it just becomes like a nuisance. Uh, I think we have some of those that I can use up that I'll let I'll tack it down into place. And the same thing with our I'll cut out the bone color masks for the Huntress, and then we'll also do the whites for the white and silver for Scream before we screen print over them. Yeah. Bummer, but now we know. Now we know. Which also then is going to make me consider maybe I screen print, oh. Maybe this means then that I screen print the black for Death Note on top of white paper. Maybe. It would be a lot of ink. Because I'm trying to think, I'm like, okay, well then how are we going to the white on the black for Death Note? Because I want it to do the hands coming up like there's a book and then it to say Death Note at the top and then to have the apples that hang down from it. I don't want it to just be cut out paper and call it a day. That seems cheesy. But yeah, it would be to, to black screen print on top of white. So that means then I would not need... Because I was going to preemptively cut out the black paper for it, but that would be a no on the black paper because we would need the white paper. Well, this has got like a shimmer to it. Why does? Why is it shiny on one side? Okay, now I'm thrown. I thought it was white paper. And then when I pulled it out, 
It was shiny on the other side. Oh. Metallic finish on the other side. Not really white paper. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. Not Death Note, but more Lisa Frank. More Lisa Frank than Death Note. Okay. More Lisa Frank than Death Note. Wasn't uh, what I thought it was. Wasn't what I thought it was going to be. Hello, Combat Wombat. Happy Monday. How was your weekend? My weekend was great. Uh, Stitch is not feeling so well, and that's why uh, we are about to end stream so I can go and hang out with him. Uh, I'm going to call some more vets. Slanemius let me know that uh, the places that I found in some of the cities around us were not too far away that I should give them a ring dingling. Some of our community members have also let me know, too, that... Uh, one of Athlov, your recommendations, was literally right around that, the corner from Mama Dis's house. He was, he was sick yesterday, but he wasn't to the thought, the point that we're like, oh, well, you know, he was throwing up. He was still eating. But we equated it to like a hairball. And it wasn't until like last night and then into this morning that we're like, okay. This has been happening a little bit too frequently. So now, now we're in the, let's make a vet appointment. Let's make a vet appointment. But I've been calling around trying to find a vet all morning uh, in every single vet office, even the ones with shitty ass reviews in this city are all not accepting new clients. I'm guessing uh, one of the vets said that a hospital in the area closed down and that all of their clients had to be, you know, they said we took in all of their clients. Well, you obviously weren't the only one that took in all of their clients because everybody else is saying that they can't fit them until the fall. Or if I wanted to make an emergency, it was like $400 extra to show up. And I was like, I'm going to keep calling. I'm going to keep calling. Give it another day. He's lethargic and just laying around. He wouldn't eat his favorite wet food, but he ain't like half of a churu. Uh, I, I'm, I'm monitoring, but like, I, I just, I feel like, yeah, it's, 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 he would be just visiting the vet early too. So like make it with his checkup. Magic thighs, welcome on in. He'll act like nothing is wrong tomorrow for you guys. But, yeah. Puck got, Puck got two helpings of wet food, which never happens. Puck looked at me like, I'm going to eat his food too. You cool with that? And I'm like, eat. I tried to even like, if I'm holding him, give him the wet food and he wouldn't, he wouldn't take it. Tried to give him like the food in his favorite room. I was like, well, let's go into the office then. You love, you love the gaming room. Let's, what if you got to eat your wet food in the gaming room? Uh, and he was like, no, I don't want to eat wet food. And I was like, oh my gosh. Stitch not well. Uh, he's drinking the water. So it, I, I did, uh, I have been creeping and watching him. And I uh, cleaned out all of the litter boxes today. And before a stream, he did use the litter box and, and to, to, he did pee in the litter box. He did go number one. Um, So yeah, stitches, stitches got, uh, hopefully it's just an upset tummy. Hopefully like maybe he, you know, we're done with the food. Maybe like the, the food that we were recommended from the previous vet is no longer something that, you know, his stomach can, I'm hoping that it's just something as easy as that. You know, maybe we just need to fitch, switch up the food. Maybe, you know, I got, I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying not to freak out, but then, you know, after the fourth vet told me that they had no openings until the fall i was i just like broke down i was like what do you what, what do i do then one of the vets told me don't worry just to keep calling around there are a lot more vets in the state and i was like what i just wanna i wanna <laughs> oh no signs of cold like a runny nose his eyes are just like big and sad i don't know and maybe like i'm just projecting myself onto him but like i just i just feel so bad for him i just wish he would tell me what's wrong like tell me what hurts he lets me pick him up so i know that like he outside of the body doesn't hurt um 
but yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm just monitoring. I'm in the, the monitoring ready to pick up food. I, at least he ate. I know he, at least he has a full churu from might've taken him three hours to eat it, which is so not like stitch. And you know that three hours to eat a churu, a little, a little, car- little cat go He like eats it in like three seconds. Um, but I know he's at least got that, and I did see him. I, I, like, picked him up and brought him to the water, and I, like, refilled one of the water dishes again, too, to see, like, maybe, like, did you just need me to see me? Like, fresh water from the Brita! You know, like, you get the fancy bougie bitch water, too! Uh, and he was like, nah, he, so he drank some water from, from the... Then he just goes and lays back down. He's just, he's just very lethargic right now. So we'll just keep watching. He doesn't go outside. He's just an indoor cat. So I'm trying not to freak out. You know, he he's 12 years old. I know that too. But uh yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. And in, in the meantime, just, you know, send send uh the good wishes and and some some happy tummy thoughts to Stitch. Happy tummy th- thoughts and like I can't imagine how his esophagus feels with the hairballs and the, ooh, and it was, oh, poor guy. Poor guy. There's no more hair. Like, after, like, we, we brushed him, too, because he was throwing up quite a bit two days ago. And we're like, oh, we'll just brush him, you know, and then everything went well. And then, like, now he's doing the throw up and there's nothing in, like, so it's just, oh, poor guy. Poor guy. But, all right. Gross conversation off to the side. I appreciate you guys. I know that we started stream and I was all over the place mentally. Um, so thank you. Thank you for, for bringing me back, back to stitches. Yeah, stitch needs a, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go cuddle with him. I'm gonna go cuddle with stitch. <laughs> cuddle, I'm gonna go clean this, uh, this tray off and, and go cuddle with the, the cat. Um, but I will see you guys tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. It's the next stream. We'll have more of the reactive going on. I should probably uh, take that boop boop off. You probably don't need the boop boop, right? Let me see here. Let's go to sound, audio. Soundboard volume controls the sound. What if that, what does that do? Nope, that's still, that still makes it, that still makes it. Uh, turn this on, make other people's voices, no, noise suppression. Audio subsession. I'll have to figure out what that is. I'll figure out what that noise is. Maybe it's uh, something I've got to turn off from the big guy. From the big overseeing battle station. We'll find out. But tomorrow. Tomorrow. We'll have uh, more reactive going. We'll do more of the Discord stuff. Uh, I'll be able to troubleshoot more things too from the uh, the big battle station on the main floor. Then in the art studio, which which is transportable. We uh, This is the computer that we bring when we live stream from conventions and everything so yay but i appreciate you guys i will see you tomorrow morning 10 a.m i'm not gonna raid we're just gonna shut this thing down and i'm gonna go downstairs and hang out um yeah we'll see maybe stitch will want to do some neopet dailies but i'm not gonna force him to it thank you so much you guys have a uh, a wonderful rest of your day combat wombat Athlon, thanks for your recommendations. Magic Thines, thank you so much for checking in. I hope you're doing well. Thomas, thanks so much for being here. Dr. Evil, Jobalai, I appreciate you guys. Sinemius, I hope your day at work is going well. Karak, thanks for playing some Stream Raiders with me. We had some other friends pop in too, so forgive me. Jessica Ray was here as well, if I'm missing you. Adam, I hope the rest of your day goes well. Stay hydrated if you're outside, Adam. Pabstio was here. The Nick M2 was here. No, I appreciate you guys. Uh, We'll be back to uh, 
Holy cross, hanging in there. Yeah, I, 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 I mean, like, I'm just sad because, like, I just don't know what to do. And this is the first time, you know, Stitch has been sick and he's, you know, my first fur child. So, like, it's, it's just, it's just, like, it's just a lot. It was just a lot. It was, it's, it's, we're, we're going to figure this out. We're going to, I'm going to keep a level head and uh, I will keep you guys posted. So, hopefully... Hopefully, our stream week this week gets wonderfully interrupted, and I have to be like, hey guys, we've got to start stream late because I've got to go take Stitch to the vet. You know, like, so that's, that's what we're hoping for. Keep your fingers crossed that uh, Stitch can get a vet appointment, and, like, tomorrow, Wednesday at the latest, like, we, we, we have to change our stream time around. That's what we're saying we're crossing fingers i'm gonna make some bunch of phone calls with uh, a cat in my lap and hopefully i'm really hoping guys i'm holy cross i'm hoping the cat clinic so you said the cat clinic uh that i found is not too far away and so i'm hoping like they'll be like they'll feel bad for me and they'll be like yeah no bring your cat in we're a cat clinic we 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 never turn away cats right right Gah! all right I will, uh, I will talk to you guys tomorrow if something happens. Uh, I will update you guys in the Discord. The Discord also has a live chatting uh, channel. Once I have uh, debriefed you guys on like, hey, don't be a tool, don't say inappropriate things, I will uh, add role of live chat to our Discord community members upon approval, upon our mutual under uh, understanding that if you say you only get one chance so you mess up i'll ban you from the whole community because like your voices are live but all right peace out you guys and i will see you tomorrow morning tentatively at 10 a.m eastern standard time unless we can get stitch into the vet come on vet we need at least one of you guys to be accepting new patients my Twitch community has left me feeling pretty positive. I've got three cities now to check since my own is not accepting anybody. But, all right. Peace out, you guys. Love for each. Have a good one. And I will see you guys in the morrow. Bye!